Ah, oh, Hajime Mashinchi. Let's get started. I think... Do a little bit more mining. Let's see how this works. Hello. Hmm. Well, I'm just gonna see if anyone decides to pop in voice. Answer is probably no. Hmm. Oh come on. What is this gonna take? Is this gonna take? Come on. And of course, loading in is going to take some time, but we'll see what it's like. There should be one person on right now. Server owner. I have to wait for this all to pop in. That's what my life has become. Constantly waiting, and, but I should not die. Shouldn't be a chance of me dying midway because, well... I'm inside my house, and unless someone fell in my location and just blew my... Blew me to pieces and I fold my down. There shouldn't be a problem, but me when the Minecraft Forge 1.20.1 dash multiplayer open parentheses third party server close parentheses space open parentheses not responding close parentheses. <sighs> there shouldn't be a problem. I do have the ice bowl set up. Back of the computer does seem to be nice and cool. Okay, there we are. Now, let me see. I where did. Okay, so he's on. Hello. For any of that, I think we should get started with our mining. Go back down and see now that we have. And of course, opening the inventory takes time too. Gotta pick up some. Food, put away some stuff. I don't have a source of weather, which means, well, first what I need to do is make more chests. Come on, come on. Put the torch over the, over the bed. That's decent enough. And why is there a wandering trader in my house? Voice powder being carbon and sulfur is interesting. Don't need the flower force, don't need that. That said, Berserker's Fury is actually good in this mod pack. In Dawncraft, it was basically useless. Because in Dawncraft, oh, strength would be incorporated into determining. Oh, that's interesting. Into determining the cost of an attack, meaning that stamina cost. Okay, and one out of two players sleeping. Anybody else gonna sleep? But it, there is a toggle that he could set that would allow it to be send like half of the players online having to sleep. Okay. Well, I have no interest in poking that bear right now, but first, where did I put all my fish? I'm gonna have to make one of those bookworm. Hello, Frey Noel. Thank you for the follow. How are you doing? I'm having a good time playing all the mods 9. I'm doing alright. Do you have something to sell me? Unfortunately, I am not interested in buying anything right now, but thank you for the offer. I will keep you in mind. Okay, so where should I put more chests? Acacia? I have a lot of other wood and... Yep. Hmm. I'm gonna have to wait a bit then. Let's just take my crafting table and a stick. That said, I should probably make a crafting spell instead. So that I don't need to in Arznevo. Okay, okay, now he's sleeping. Okay, there we go. Okay, I, I'm a little busy right now, but thank you. Okay, so now it's daytime. Let's chop down some of these trees. I got a chest. I guess I could break some of this wall. Why is he making an evil face? What is that supposed to mean? So, pickaxe is a good option, right? Night vision potion, pickaxe. Very literal names here. 
then will this, is there anything underneath? Okay, things are lagging a little, but it should be horrible. Let's make another storage room in here and I suppose go out and break a few more trees so that I can have wood to actually do things with. with. Oh my goodness, I'm so tired, I'm wisping. But that night vision should not do much of anything. It's gonna hop up top. Yeah, yeah, I've got those bunny slippers reducing fall damage and also... Well, making me immune to fall damage and also just increasing my jump height, but... I think I can... Okay, just barely can't hit that. Oh my goodness. That's tough. So in that case, I think we can fill her up again. I have no interest, sorry. At least not right now. Have a nice evening. Oh, and interesting, so there's a limit to the distance at which wood can sort of maintain trees. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do a jump. Okay, that just did not work. Oh, yeah, mahogany would actually be a pretty nice piece kind of wood to use as a basis for building. Big thing is apparently that temple over there well, it's presuming that dungeon have very, very nice loot, according to someone else. One of the other players on here apparently lives in one of those temples. One of those big Aztec style temples, which apparently are essentially based off of Stargate. The Oh, and... Hmm, hmm. I'm going to need to put some stuff away. And luckily, is that offhand right now? I'm not... <clears throat> I let's just light up this area. There's no reason not to. Wonder how long it'll take that projectile to dispel, and it doesn't really dispel. And having light around here instead of darkness would suit my purposes. Wouldn't be really fun. I could just scatter a bunch of mage lights around the entire external area, but the big question is if someone eventually finds this location. I wouldn't like it to be too conspicuous. That said, I am very, very far away, but still. It, it's not as far away as random teleports can send me sometimes. So, big thing is, put some stuff away right now. And then, craft myself a few more chests. And this should be a good amount for now, but it's just... So many things shared between all the mods. I do appreciate that. Really? Okay. I do appreciate that. Okay. Oh, and that place the torch. I hate that. They don't have individual chests for each wood type in this mod pack, or at least if they do, I could check that in theory. It's not automatic that it selects the specific type of chest. Because in... Yeah, you can make specific chests with Quark, but it doesn't automatically select them. So in Dawncraft, it automatically selected that, and there wasn't a button to sort of toggle different crafting results. So it was very easy to end up in a situation where... Oh, you had incompatible chests, which to be fair could be used to ensure that... I should do some reordering and reorganizing. But let's just put as many of these things away as we can and do some organizing in a bit. All I know is, check out some of this theurgy stuff. Divination routes for ore finding, Spagyrix, mastery over water, separate reunite, three principles, elements of matter, salt, sulfur, sulfur, and mercury, total control over all aspects, any type of matter from any other type, and reuse of materials, manifold, efficient refining of raw materials, Transforming one material into another. Hello, how are you doing? It's good to see you again. Stressing. I was wondering if this was going to be maybe a little too late for you, but it's good to see you. Souls are essentials. Three basic elements all things are made of unrelated to common materials is in table salt, metallic mercury, and mineral sulfur. Yeah, exactly. Especially since I do actually have some stuff com stuff in the middle of comms. Now. Literally. Yeah, all, every, all three of those M's also stand for Minecraft. Minecraft, 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 Minecraft. That's fair. Yeah, I 
my sister will be going off to college soon, so I can do more evening streams now, which should be nice. So, representing body, matrix for sulfur and mercury, the act, material, stability, manifestation, sulfur is the soul, unique property, select field interaction, determining sulfur, underlying idea of transmutation, mercury, energy, or life force, most elusive, enables the other two to function. Or refining triple your ore yield. Oh. Refining of ores and raw metals, smelting metal is wasteful, single ingot per ore, a lot of precious raw materials, last iota of value. Process more complex, refining into multiple ingots, three iron ingots out of one raw iron in Spagyrix. Liquefy it with metal sulfur, mineral salt, a body, and mercury shards. Ride mercury for the soul. Trees process retaining all and creating iron ingots. I, well, acquired apparatus. So we're getting into alchemy. Yeah, go ahead. Apparatus needed, apparatus category, four of these paramedic braziers. Shift. Blow to heat them up, right click with fuel. Oh wow, that that's kind of frightening. So what ended up happening there? Okay. Four of these to power the other apparatuses, calcination oven, create mineral salt. So in other words, Tails was wrong. Modding your 3DS is not surprisingly easy to do, it's surprisingly difficult. Oh also, there was a new trailer for the new Zelda game. That came out today, and it was really cute. They showed that you could have multiple outfits, and that she could ride a little cute little horse. It all has a very much sort of a toy aesthetic to it, which I like. Sort of, one of my friends has a figure of Wink from the Link's Awakening remake. It's gotten a lot messed up over time, and the paint has flaked off and gotten faded, but... It really shows how toy the aesthetic is. Alchemical salt, body physical matter, like a brazier, mineral salt... Sal ammoniac. Oh, that's sal ammoniac by water by evaporation. Increased concentration. Solvent stored in the liquefaction cauldrons. Right click to fill the accumulator. Consume to fill the sal ammoniac tank below. I feel like source gems from. Oh, ours in the Sal ammoniac tank. Solvent. Sal ammoniac alchemical sulfur idea or soul. Paramatic brazier. Top of the heating device, mercury shards, energy, and then to store for processing. Oh, it was a Wi-Fi issue. Oh, yeah. Ouch. Salt, store for mercury, one each to hold the input materials. Control, pyromatic brazier, incubator vessels for all three ingredient types adjacent horizontally. Well, ammoniac, salt, ammoniac tank. Well, that's interesting, but you can figure that out after I've gone through the area. And oh my goodness. Thumbcraft is not in this pack, right? Ah, uh, yeah, Thumbcraft is not in this pack. Thumbcraft upgrade, work in progress, because Thumbcraft is not here. I, didn't I make something for alchemistry too? Yeah, the classic misspelled folder, that'll get you. Let's just put most of this away. I wonder what might have fluorite. I think a good amount of yield, but okay, so let's actually just make an actual crafting table real quick to make that craft spell. Big thing for me right now as well, we could get rid of this oak log. We've got saplings, so it I many, many years ago there was a mod pack called Natural Magic that I played on I think it was 1.18 or something a while ago. Playloads. It they were just discriminating against Italians. They were being mean to you and you specifically. That's what was going on. Ouch. That's frightening. I... Maybe maybe it just hated you. You have to accept that possibility. Let's put this in and... Question is, what would I need for Conjure Mage Light? Also, I need... I Not that, not that. I don't even need torches anymore. I've got Conjure Mage Light. My question is, Conjure Mage Block, and that just takes Amplify, cause it to be permanent, but we don't have Amplify yet. Dispelling will destroy it instantly. Hmm. Just need 8 glass. It's not bad, but... Uh, we need... I guess I could go over and get some sand before going back to my home real quick, but... What does get at me a little bit, well also, even if it won't do a lot of damage. I do have a magic missile spell, which is good. 
But I should get some sand, make some glass. Just for conjure mage block, because eventually and that can be free building material. Not anything pretty, but if I just need to make staircases or towers inside my inside a mine shaft or something, or inside a cave I'm mining in, that would be useful. I think I'd like to explore that dungeon today. Well, the other thing is, we got a lot of salt from underneath here, which was nice. Figure things out. Figure out how this is going to work. A lot of salt at the bottom of this riverbed. Yeah, well, I do have some armor, which is nice. If you see down here, you get a lot of salt. Okay, orange sand, we can make that into regular glass. But that's for mechanism. I actually did not die a single time yesterday. Okay. Well, once Larry decides to start sleeping, I will go back and also start sleeping. If you're here, hello, Larry. It... I, I don't think that's how that works. And if it is, that makes you a bad luck charm. I'm not sure that's the kind of thing you'd like to brag about. Well, I, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. It was, there were a number of times where I got close to death. Which cosmos... I did find one single Herbotania flower. It'd be cool to get started on that, but... <sighs> Finding ways to multiply ores would be good. Storage organization, as well as ores, are good ideas. Can we get a fern there? It... Are you gonna say that that's an Italian trait, too? Some people might object to that statement. Or even if it's a southern Italian statement, too. Because to the extent that Larry is Italian, which I contend is not much. Oh, okay. He's Southern Italian, so. You can. I, I did mention that, didn't I? Okay, well, nobody's sleeping right now, so we can just put sand in here and get Conjure Mage Block. I got a lot of glyphs right now, which means. Well, we don't have. What's up, man? Oh, it's good to see you. Good to see you. I can unmute myself now because people are actually in here. How are you doing? It's been some time. <laughs> but it's good. it's good to actually be on here. It Yeah, it took you long enough. Well, it's because I was waiting for things to stabilize and then schedule myself. And also, there was Elden Ring to be doing last uh, week. Of course. We, were, we were briefly discussing the nature of Southern Italians, and I said that to the extent that you are Italian, you are Southern Italian, and I contend that that... I'm not, it. actually. My grandfather's from Frozenone. Oh, 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 so you're, you're Northern Which is, Italian? I, I, no, Central. Oh, okay. fuck Northern Italian. Central Brutal. Italian, Central Italian. So it's like Kalos from X and Y? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, Mountain Italy, Central Italy, and Coastal Italy. Actually, literally. Mm -hmm. Quite literally, actually. Well, dude, the Milanese can go eat my shorts, dude. Eat pan... <laughs> Yeah. Okay. So, what mods have you been using lately? Because I've been... Alright, so the ones that I've mainly been doing... So, to give you a brief recap on oh. sort of my time in the server. I made a house near spawn. Fair. Um, and I was like, oh, I can find this... You know, I'll build, I can build a house here. Kind of, this could be kind of cool. And then everybody decided to move away from spawn because... I don't know if you've looked into it yet. Teleportation is so much easier than it is in Dawncraft 2. Like, waystones... Your warp stone recharges every 30 seconds. Oh, what? Not 5 minutes. It's every 30 seconds. Okay, There's that's zero insane. point in using, like, slash home commands. Just throw a waypoint at your, uh... At your base. Or, a, yeah, like, a, or a waystone. Throw a waystone at your base. Well, yeah, because that means it has um, shorter cooldown than the set home command. Yes. <laughs> Which is kind of ludicrous. Um, yeah, warp stones are busted. Um, but I made this thing, I made this house, and went mining and very quickly realized, after the amount of looting I was doing, very quickly, very quickly realized, uh, we need fucking, I needed so much um, storage space. I was like, all right, mm. the first thing I'm doing, actually, screw this. Uh, first thing I'm doing is, um, getting a big computer. Oh, oh, computer craft and, for storage? Uh, yeah. Well, not necessarily, it's not computer craft. They, I think they split it up. 
There's okay. refined storage and applied energistics too. But those are the storage and mods I should be using. Yes. Okay, I'll keep uh, that in mind. Well, there's the basic storage mods. If you've been using the quest book, the like the whole, like if you press, if you go to your backpack and look at the quest books. I was gonna use like, Ars Nouveau's bookworm stuff for storage because you can link a lot of inventories. I've been using Ars Nouveau because obviously having an infinite use pickaxe is incredibly useful. But well, also you're familiar with it. Yeah, that too. But. Um, well, no, there's some basic storage stuff. My main goal, I wanted to maneuver away from things i, I want to try out most things that I, that I haven't been doing before that's fair. like i, I don't want to go with both i mean i might end up doing botania eventually just because it's so much easier well uh, i simply have not done botania. Been, i i would i convince I, I, like anybody who has not done botania i i encourage them to do it just because it's an, especially like all the people who on the server who haven't really used any like magic mods yeah um, in Minecraft thus far, they've been, um, th I've always encouraged them to use Botania. Like, Jack, I'm encouraging him to use Botania. Um, Re, I'm, I'm encouraging her to use Botania. Like, pretty much everybody, I'm like, use, b do Botania first. You get the, all the tools you need really early. Um, and you can, it's easy to start out and it's simple enough to follow. And the guidebook is very, um, very helpful. Um. But, yeah, I recommend... So I always recommend Botania. I'm not doing Ars Nouveau, because um, we did that in Dawncraft, and I don't really... I mean, it was it was fun, but I want to I wanna see if I can move through something else. But this yeah. is... It seems more like an updated version of Ars Nouveau, because I think there's just way more... A lot of things like, that were on the wiki... Ski is actually available. What, what, yeah, yeah. Big thing is break. I've been making much, much use out of that, but... Big thing yeah. is, is a lot of the things mentioned on the wiki just weren't in Dawncraft because they, it was not the latest version of Dawncraft for whatever reason. I wonder if it was because we were on a, an earlier version of the pack, but I don't think it was just that. Given that, um, I think they banned some stuff just in terms of interacting. Well, with they the did. They, they got rid of Break. They got rid of Summon Steed. They got rid of Conjure Mage Block, and they nerfed Conjure Mage Light so you couldn't make it permanent, but. The big thing is, and let me just check. Oh, that's right, because I do need actual normal. Ye well, yeah, yeah, because Conjure Mage Light is permanent at base, which is not how it is in Dawncraft, and just, oh, yeah. it's not fully upgraded. It's not fully, I mean, not fully updated, which means that you can't make stabilized warp scrolls, which is precisely why we had to go through so many weird steps to transport that Ignis to our Dreamy farm. Because we didn't have the ability to just instantly transport things between dimensions using a warp scroll, which is mm. very, very possible in any updated version yeah. of Ars Nouveau. But, um, but yeah, will... so I'm doing a, I'm doing different mods that I, I have yet to do. Um, so the first thing I did was do refined storage. Now, I've, I think I've done refined storage before, technically, but I remember when it was just computer craft. And there are, like different i'm i want to say that applied energistics 2 and refined storage were a part of like the same thing but it, I, I could just be tripping they could just be very similar um i know that but i'm using refined storage it is dude i got one drive with 64k like a 64k storage drive it, it's made all like i'm i only have 9000 items like it, it is so nice just being able to dump everything in like the storage that was the biggest thing for me so i did that um but i uh as people were moving away from spawn like, the base like moving away from spawn i was like you know what let me actually like find a new spot to make like a bigger cooler more permanent base more hidden um yeah and I found, so I basically just got in a boat and, or just like went north and just set out on my own journey to try and find something. Yeah, well, fair. Find something that looked cool. Um, I ended up finding this like cliff. And as soon as I knew it, as soon as I came across it, I'm like, yep, this is what I'm using. Um, I came across this cliff on this like ocean side 
um, that overlooks know. everything. And like, I'm making like, I'm definitely making like a superhero secret base that juts out of a cliff. Oh, that's cool. As opposed so, to me, who's gonna have to make right a super now. villain secret base. Yeah, really. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, but no, that's so that's what I did now. Uh, I just finished actually building the first layer of the base because I needed oh, nice. so many mats. Um, but I've got the rest of it kind of drawn out. Hmm. Um, but right now, the other mods that I'm working with are Mystical Agriculture and... Which I is how would... I used to get the Obsidian to get to my base. Oh, nice. Mystical Agriculture is busted. I um, was definitely going to use it because I was mentioning before that I had... There was a mod pack called Natural Magic that I played on 1.18 or something like that years ago between junior and senior year of high school. And the big thing... No, I think it was between sophomore and junior. It's been a while. But the main thing is... Oh my goodness. It feels like just since Dawncraft... Dawncraft's boost to enemy HP is not in here. The damage from Ars Nouveau spells is so much better. Just the fact... I can pretty easily just kill most things from range with ma with a basic range well, arm spell, which feels get weird. Harder. Well, of course, but I haven't amplified it at all. It's, well, not this is like just base. base enemies, no, but there are a lot more of like mini, like higher tier enemies. Well, the they've got apotheosis in here, so yeah. But, um, but wait. no, I've uh, oh. like I ran into a blaze with like 140 health. Oh wow! Um, as one of the apotheosis things. Um, oh, that. But no, so the two mods I've really time. been using are mystical agriculture and blood, and uh, not blood magic. Um, evil craft. Oh, uh, evil craft. Evil craft is like instead of blood magic, which is more stereotypical, like blood magic, where you take blood from yourself, you hurt yourself, and it powers your stuff. Um, this one is like you collect blood from other. Like, via other methods. I know, you, s uh, you sent a picture of the Dark Temple in the server, the weather control one. Yeah, I, if you find one of those, I need to go there. Okay, interesting. Well, information comes at a price. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll see what happens. Right. We'll, see how co we'll see how cooperative I end up being. But... Well, again, I'm doing evil crap. Like, I kind of want to play the part of, like, a... Um, like, I'll help people out, but, like, I kind of want to, like, do my own, like, dabble in the dark arts and see yeah, what yeah. becomes of me. Well, I eventually um, want to master everything, as one does, so we'll see where that takes me. 100 percenting this mod pack is going to take you a whole while. Oh, yeah, that's the idea. Um, but the big thing yeah, is... So... Well, so I'm doing blood magic right now, or uh, evil craft right now, and once I finish that, I don't know what I'm going to move on to, but it might be one of the tech mods. That's fair. I know I've talked to various people about the idea of having people join me on my journey of evil and getting evil c collaborators or goons, basically. <laughs> yeah, if, if you want to be a cooperator in evil with me, no, I don't think you would like the title of Goon. Okay. But well, also, I just wouldn't... If I did, I just wouldn't follow everything you said. That's fair. Like, you'd give me a task, and I'd be like, okay. And then just not, not do, do it. it, or betray yeah, it, or yeah. whatever. Well, which is part of why I still have my location as a complete secret. Yeah. It... I've thought about the idea of creating other bases, especially now that you've told me that warp stones are comically easy to recharge and use. Of making... Oh, we've hit Deep Slate. Of essentially using multiple bases. One that I... My real base, which is secret, and then other bases for interacting with other people, basically. Yeah. Sort of various kinds of sub-bases, then. It's an idea. Deep Slate Iron Ore... Right next to other iron ore. You know what? I need to go... To the bathroom? No. Oh, okay. Nickel slate? Huh. They have so many ores, yeah. Thank you for telling me Yeah, there's an absurd amount of ores. Telling yeah, me that was the problem. It wasn't necessarily the amount of items he was getting. It was the fact Times. that they were all different, so they couldn't stack. 
Yeah, because I I need to figure out a storage solution, and if applied energistics is that good, I mean, refined storage well, is that I'm good. Well, I'm using I'll refined storage. It. Basically, the main difference is refined storage is really good, like early on, where you could just set a computer down. It gives you a shit ton of storage, but it's not the easiest to work with. Mm. Apart from that, whereas applied energistics two takes is very complicated. It takes a while to set up. But once you get it going, you can pretty much computerize anything you want to do. Interesting. Okay. Because I was like wondering... Snap, like, snap your fingers and get a bunch of resources with the oh, touch wow. of... Like, it's, like, absurd. It's, like, something that doesn't even deserve to be in Minecraft. Yeah, I was wondering what my balance of sort of tech versus magic mods would be then. But, well, of course, eventually I'd want to do everything, but... Like I was saying, I've talked to Esteban about the idea of being an evil collaborator. I talked to a guy who, a friend of a friend. I think he's hopped on the server yet. Yeah, I, I told him, and he said he wants. He doesn't even know if it'll work yet. But I told him that if and when it does, he should. We should collaborate a little. I think I think he would be a good evil goon. I think he would like, just, being a goon. I think it would. He he would get I a lot out. Of, so. Well, it, he would get a lot out of the experience. At least out of being evil one way or another. And, oh, hello there, Mister Algernon Sparagus. It's I, JK. Oh, okay. That that's very in character for him. Okay. Okay, come on. And there we go. Strange grave dust. Ah, right, exactly. And that's why I. W to ponder, crafting spirits for crafting for tombstone. That's good. The tombstone stuff is interesting. I, I think I mentioned this to you before, but is that diamonds? That can't be that might be diamond. I mentioned this to you before, but I know there's a toggle for Oh, I maybe. I think it would be nicer than that. Machiavelli famously said, and as you may or may not know. That it, it might be better to be feared than loved, but the most important thing is to avoid being quote unquote hated and despised. I like bringing that quote out. But as I was saying. Oh my goodness. A bit raw silver and. Oh, it's a big piece. Big piece of raw silver. Hmm. What am I thinking about right now? I don't know what I'm thinking about right now. It's so hot, and my room has the worst ventilation in the whole house, that it's actually hard to think. It sucks. But, I think some evil, evil cooperation between us could be fun. But, like I was saying, there's a friend of a friend who is interested in hopping on. Oh, I, what I was going to say is that there's a ice bowl. The ice bowl is going. It's... Only doing so much though, but as I was saying, there's a toggle which is not on in the server right now that allows you to loot other people's tombstones, but it's not on right now, and I'm wondering if you wanted that on or off, if other people had weighed in on that. No, I, I didn't want that on for now. Fair. We're not in a state of open war yet. No. So is it about that or not about that? So that was prosperity or not. Hmm. Have you found any good ways to automate farming yet? Not automate, but I know mystical agriculture. Um, oh, it's both of them. Or not necessarily mystical agriculture, but like, because that is the farming. But there are ways to automate a lot of stuff, um, like, without even using Ars Nouveau, like, uh... Trick me farms. Like Whirless Briggs or anything. The big thing is that the containment ritual actually is in this mod pack when it was not in Dawncraft because it wasn't fully updated. And I don't mean dummied out, I mean it just wasn't in the game because they didn't have the version that actually had it. So, okay, we got magma. Break some of this magma. That's more the resonating ore. Slate Arcane Crystal. Huh. 
I... Let's get this magma. There was something I wanted magma for, but I can't really remember what it was now. It might have been for Ars Nouveau. But there are a lot of Ars Nouveau add-ons in this mod pack too. It's not just the base of what we saw before. So... That's Forbidden and Arcanus. In particular, they have a lot of elemental spells. There are a lot of lightning-associated things you can do in Ars Nouveau now because of the add-ons. So that might interest you, actually. Because I know how much you like electricity. Huh? What's up? Oh, oh, that there are a lot of add-ons for Ars Nouveau in the mod pack right now. And one of them adds a lot of lightning-associated spells beyond just the lightning strike from before. So you might like trying some of that, maybe. Just for, for Ars Nouveau? Well, there's a, there's just a lot of stuff going on in Triad. That's fair. But I want to stay clear of Ars Nouveau for now, because I've already kind of experimented with the mod. Yeah. And I want to just, I want to try out new stuff for the time being. That's sensible. Have you gotten any good artifacts? Oh, hi Kozu, how are you doing? What do you mean by artifacts? Oh, oh! Artifacts is in... Sort of equipable pieces. Various little... I got some bunny slippers that increased my jump height. Which was interesting. And also just negate fall damage. Well, welcome back to the world of the living, Kozer. Okay. Oh, sorry, I should mute myself. Kornichi Wart. Let's go back top side. So is there anything else you found that's been interesting for you? Okay. Um Arcane Crystal. Get yeah. There. Well there's a bunch of really cool stuff. Diamond Sight is a potion that gives you X ray vision for diamond ore, and it does that for pretty you can do that for pretty much any ore in the game. It is absurdly broken. Uh, it's how I got two stacks of diamonds without any efficiency or any, um, any, like, advanced strategies. Well, I've just been caving to mine. There are enough, th there's enough there, but using diamond sight was just, like, ridiculous. Okay, so it was refined storage, network-based storage system. Interesting. Why am I gonna need to craft this? Oh, but how did you get energy for your controller? A uh, bunch of stuff. There's a plenty of different power options. The easiest one that I found was something called a Furnator from the Power mod. Um, I just made a Furnator and put some coal in it, and it powers my things with coal. Oh, okay. Or with any sort of fuel, but I'm using coal. That makes sense. Well, thank you for the tips. I like that. I'm just trying to figure out how best to get ore, double it, and so on and so forth. What are you doing for food? I know that evil craft. Uh, is... that's a big thing. I am. What I'm trying to do. What I'm trying to advance evil craft for is for their infinite food source. Oh, the infinite flesh. Yeah. I it's wanted like to do that. Flesh and it's like an infinite food source. It's I awesome. I wanted to do that. With the single piece of flesh I got from Jake when I killed him on spawn at the very, very start when we were testing things off. I've still got my Jake flesh, and I want to use it as my infinite food source. Is that a particularly nice thing to do? No. But I do want to do it. Mm. Yeah, still yeah, do you have Jake flesh that you're gonna... Well, basically, do you just have some random humanoid flesh? Do you have your own... Because I know that you I can... have my own. I only have my own, actually. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, have you tried eating flesh yet? No, because then you it would be gone, it. and, well, it gives you a bunch of bad effects. Uh, it drops you to, like, one health. Yeah. <laughs> no matter how much health you have. Oh, hilarious. interesting. So, in other words, what you're saying is I should lie about and trick someone else into eating it who trusts me. That said, I don't think anyone would trust me right now, which is a good idea. No. Uh, well, because both of us have basically said that I should be the villain of the server. No, to be fair, I, I think a lot of us, I think everyone will end up being a villain in some way. Or at least it's going to be an every man for himself kind of situation. 
It... It seems like how things are going to end up. That's my hunch. And... Okay, more iron. Anything up there, or... Let's take that. Hmm. Should be... Anything in there. Well, it... Well, Dom disagreed that he would be a good goon. There, there's a bit of contention over that. Yeah, what the hell are you talking about being a goon? Fuck you. I didn't say you would be the goon. Yeah, I know. Come on. We gotta, um, we, we gotta feed this guy to worms. A runic deep sleep. Yeah, I have more diamond than I do iron. Oh wow. I'm trying to get a bunch of iron, but yeah, I've, I got, I've, I have like a ridiculous amount of diamonds. How did, how did Jack make his name green? Uh, I made it a mod because he's paying for the server, so I can make you a mod. Oh, okay, well. Then I'd make my name orange. Or, or I don't know. Or, I, I, my name is green, too. Otherwise, I'd Oh, okay, green. all of them are green. Okay. That reminds me... Okay, it's probably a, maybe an FTB set thing. I just remember that mods were green on that one server I was on when I was in middle school back then with TB, actually. Thank you for making me a server operator. I promise not to abuse this power. Don't. Or else I'll strip it. I'll take it away. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm glad you avoided saying the word strip. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well... Alright, so let's see. Can I do... The big thing is that, are you aware of the mod that got added? Some of the mods got that got added in the last update to all the mods. This um... is... This is There's just, a... What do you mean? This is just between me and you, but they added Draconic Evolution. Oh, yeah, I saw that. Thank you for getting water instead of monster. Don't die. Yeah, it... It'll oh, be shit. slow Evilcraft going. Evilcraft allows you to remove enchantments and curses. What do you say? Evilcraft allows you to remove curses and enchantments. Oh, nice. Don't cobwebs allow you to do that, too? Well, they did... Yeah, they can. They did... Oh, just enchantments. Okay. So, oh my goodness. Well, it, none of you are on the Minecraft server, at least right now. Sorry. Chat, chat was getting indignant. I didn't mean to tell you that. I have a toggle that allows me to instantly mute and unmute myself, but it can be tough sometimes to remember when. Hmm. Sell ammoniac for theurgy. A lot of things I need to make that work, though. I. Do you have any rabbit's feet, actually? Uh, -huh, no, I don't. Well, I I'm sure you could figure out what I wanted to use it for. Yeah. Fortune. That would have been nice, because yeah. I just remember you found one rabbit's foot in the entirety of our... Oh, yeah. Time and Dawncraft, which... I cannot imagine that the sauna is helping. Well, it's not a sauna. It's just hot. It's not like I'm in Finland. It... Dom, you might have heard about this, but are you familiar with the World Sauna Championship? Sauna Championship? Yeah, where you just compete to try to stay in a sauna as long as possible. No, I'm not familiar with that. Yeah, and they... Someone died. Which... I suppose isn't all that surprising. When? Oh, just some years ago. I don't know when, but I read a an article someone had done about it that was just basically, yeah, it's kind of crazy that people are doing this in the first place. Because people, even when they didn't die, would just, oh, come down with massive burns and have their skin just start slowing off them. It, yeah, but I wonder whether a lot of people have moved away from spawn after previously having spawn bases and what's been done with those bases because i'm sure that a lot of people have realized that in a server without ftb chunk claims which ftb chunk claims are still on right though right yeah they are but i kind of want to make a turn them off a um 
I, I don't know how to turn them off manually. Hmm. And I'd also just rather not do that. Please take care of your ankle. Um. But no, it's like. It, 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 I wouldn't mind chunk claiming for breakage. But if you claim chunks, you can't open doors nor chests. And I don't like that. Yeah. Um, well, the big thing about it is, is that it means that if people can break and steal, it severely discourages bases near spawn, which I kind of anticipated that, which is why I don't have a spawn base, at least not right now. But I think a lot of people might be unhappy about that change, which, you know, sucks to be them, I guess. But... In the Wait, end, change? well, about getting rid of chunk claiming when there was a group, wasn't it, didn't they name their team the Glue Sniffers or something? There was somebody who's right by spawn, more or less. Uh, no, that's Jack and I's team. Oh, okay, but you don't live there anymore. Paint Hoppers, Glue Sniffers. Yeah. Well, I, yeah, I presume Huffing Paint creates more brain damage. Okay. Deep Slate and Ferium Ore. Great minds think alike. Is that... Scroll of Knowledge. Oh, oh, okay. So I guess... Let me see. Hello, Jack! Howdy, howdy. Hello, how are you doing? Cool. Good, good. It's good to talk to you. How are you doing? Wait, I already asked Yo, that server, question. You said this server's popping. It, it is! is. A lot more active than... Oh, Jack, visit my base. Hmm. Bro, I'm worried about my own stuff right now. Unless you're willing to freaking give me some things I need for this computer. What are you making with the computer? Storage. Oh, okay. So you're doing computer craft stuff? Uh, just a, I just need a computer. Or I just need the, the chest for now. I thought about trying to do some computer craft stuff, and I played around with it a bit in creative. See what I could do, but it didn't work for my purposes. And also, unlike you two, I never studied... Computer programming in college. I need to... That actually do something? What? Like, are you able to code in this thing? Yeah, it's, uh, all, it's all in Lua, but yeah. If you're a dweeb, technically, yeah. There's a, there are certain mods. Uh, wait, right on. Yeah. Chat is commenting that this is the group of people who did Dokapon. How, how do we feel about the end of Dokapon? Any regrets? It was, pretty, it was, it was fine. Fitting. It was fitting. Yeah. Fitting regrets. in what way? Because we were all cooperating at the end? No. It was just the fact that, like, I, I, it was selling the gem that made the difference. Oh, yeah. Well, because it's all about making money. That's the that's the one win condition. Money. Okay. Oops. Guess who finally is hitting diamond? This guy. There we there go. go. There we go. So what mods have you been using, Jack? Been using a good deal of well, ones, though. I will be honest. I have really not been using mods for, like, actual progression. I've mostly been building my house. That's fair. But... You should uh, let me come to your house castle. My house is made out of... Oh, yeah, you could do that. Hold up. Okay. Let me, um... Well, I'm trying to find another. I got a pig, and I'm trying to find another pig. Okay. Well, if Dom turns off FTB chunk claiming eventually, it might be a bad idea to let me know your cords. Well, we'll see what no, happens. No, no, it's uh, no. We're gonna make a. Um. Look, if you want to rob people, go ahead. But if you want to blow up, I'll some tell you people, now. I don't have anything worth robbing, dude. <laughs> If you if you want to blow up some no also what what, I'm, what I want to do is make an honor code rule, no destroying other people's blocks. Um, okay. That they worked hard to create. Okay, I'll find a workaround. All right, you can add blocks like you you can obsidian bomb some place somebody's place and just put obsidian in every corner of their house. That'd be hilarious. Um. You can do that. You can mine around somebody's base. Like you know, you can obliterate the terraforming around somebody's base. Go ahead, but I don't agree with griefing somebody's base that they worked hard on, like actually making. Um, 
because it's not it, it, it's it's just it's not even a prank. It's he knows not, like, what I can do if I'm cute unrestrained. Or fun. It's just obnoxious. Fair. Because I... we spend, we like I spent a lot of time mapping this thing out and building it. I know G Jack spent a lot of time on his base, and to just obliterate all of that, they, like that's not fun anymore. It's mean spirited. It's just mean spirited. Okay, well I, I know. I'll, I will. I'll let you come to my base. Now. Like I don't have any problems yeah. with it. Well, I know the boundaries of what I can do now. The big thing is that I need a warp stone and some waypoints, so I need a source of ender pearls before I really start going back and forth between That's my places. That's where I want th Like, ender pearls are huge for me. That's what I want. Yeah. I agree. He has a good point. And I will find whatever way I can to maneuver around it to cause problems. Okay. Let's keep on... I need to sail to find some pigs. Yeah, but Dom was telling me about refined storage, and that's something I really want to get into soon. Just because I start, that's, that's what I started. That's what I was starting. Yeah. Yeah. So, do you have any kind of connected systems, or your bases anywhere by each other? Or... Our I mean, bases are actually not like weirdly close to each other and we didn't intend for that to interesting happen. so is that why you ended up on the same team no, no we just i just found what it was team. at the start of the game and decided to add them well, just that's, because we that's complete cute. Enchantment you can join it if you have. want <laughs> well that Maybe. way i get the, i still get the rewards from completing um you'll the get the botania stuff yeah mm. i'll get all like the botania stuff even if i'm not actively doing it yeah well i probably actually want to go it alone just for the principle of the thing because i am going to be well, it's your decision kind of, yeah exactly kind of antagonistic i don't think it would make sense for me to work with anyone who wasn't also going down the path of evil and depravity you know like i said before i would be happy to have evil goons but it's not exactly the same thing okay well i suppose in that case it's time for me to get started on building a better storage system but I have a hollow in a cave, which you could see if you looked at the stream. But basically it's just in a cliff wall. So it's interesting to think where I could expand into. It. If I'm going to be evil, I'm going to be evil. That's just how these things go. Okay. Ominous forest? Is that a water creeper? What forest? An umbral forest, or ominous forest. Mm. Okay, for some reason, I can't eat food right now. I don't know what's up with that. That's just what happens when you get server lag. Okay, main thing is... I gotta craft some Ars Nouveau. Antelope? Antelope? Oh, yeah, cantaloupe? Cantaloupe. cantaloupe. Okay, I thought you said antelope. No. I mean, I've seen giraffes, so it wouldn't even shock yeah. me if they had. You can make a jackalope. Antelopes. Can you really? I was making a dumb joke. Oh, I see. Yeah, it's not letting me. It's not letting oh, me eat some... my cod. There's some foxes over there. Can't eat my fish. Well, Probably just need to. Oh, they took longer. they took cod out of the food pool. I forgot to tell you. Oh, okay, so now it's just poison like that flesh. Dude, I tried eating the, the the human the humanoid flesh. Did Dom trick you into doing that? It, no, I did it uh, because I had no food and was starving in the game, and it like instantly kills you. Yeah, I'm dying, Squirtle. Wait, okay. why does it say that the controller needs light blue dye? It doesn't even do anything. Advanced processor, quartz enriched iron, silicon, jito open guide. Oh, okay. Certus quartz crystal and where am I going to get certus quartz? SIO2. From budding certus. SIO2. Can I make something else with that? Do I have any more SIO2 somewhere? I might. Do I have what's four I no, that's CAF2. I wonder if I can search with... That's not even... 
I'm surprised that cell ammoniac isn't compatible with alchemistry. Would expect something different, maybe. But the question is just I basically mined out that cave, I got one diamond. Guess I could try more farming, but it's just sort of Honestly, I should go look inside that temple in that dungeon. Just to loot it. There'd be a number of things to get that way, hopefully. Whoa. What's going on? I don't know what I found like a big wizard tower. Does it have a big wizard in it too? I'll check in a bit. I'm taking foxes back to my base to start a fox farm. A fox farm? For their fur? Do they have fox fur in this game? Maybe. I just kind of like having them around. That, that's very pure of you. I like that. Although I don't have any of the, the berries. Mm, okay. Did you see the trailer for the new Zelda game? That came out just today, I think. I saw it recommended, but I haven't watched it. It looks pretty good. It, It's a lot more similar to Breath of the Wild than you might expect. Yeah, Jack, Jack is a pure soul. Jack, Jack, would you agree yeah. that you're a pure soul? I hope. That's fair. Okay, I found one of those Stargate temples around my base, too. Apparently Jake, Jake said he was living in one of them. Apparently there's- He's living, like, in a huge temple. Yeah, one of the Stargate temples. My question is just whether people would be able to use one of them to find me. I hope not. I don't know. Okay. Okay, yeah, there are loot chests around here. It's exciting. Oh my goodness, the loot in here is amazing. Okay. That's nice. Got a black lotus from Botania, a compressed iron chest plate. That's a lot of thing. Why does this item just say asses? <laughs> yeah, I have well, no idea. Okay. Got I think that's something you could, uh... Oh. Oh. Oh, wow. Pressure oh, to... A lot of advancement. Explosion. Apothic gem. It, some good loot in here. The question is just, how am I going to... Do you, do any of you know where a village is that I could spend these spirit orbs at? Okay, this I looks don't. like money of a sort of... I just I, that it the name base. The name Capona actually sounds kind of Italian, so I could see that. That... Yeah, because Jake was mentioning that the loot in here was really, really good. And he was right. It is. He was not. Oh, have you gone to one of the Stargate temples too? Yeah. Well, you went to the one that... Jake found? Yeah. Where is that one? Because he said I would be more than able to pay a visit if I felt like it. Well, to be fair... The... Uh, it is on the east side of the map, I think. Okay, east of, east of spawn. I know he said it was under... Oh. A thousand or so blocks away, but if it's anything like the one I found, it should be in a jungle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How are you doing these days, Jack? Oh, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I just got rubber banded back a little. Yeah, but I'm having to make multiple trips to get this stuff. It's just. Where did you find Surtis Quartz? Were you able to just grow it or find it by mining or something? Is there a dowsing rod you can use for it? Surtis quartz for refined storage. I don't know what that is. Okay, understandable. It's like quartz. You don't use you don't use Surtis quartz for refined storage. You use it for applied energistics too. Oh, okay. Well, that was looking at sun weird then. And now I'm just confused, but. I got a lot of stuff in here now. Oh, kitty slippers. Creepers avoid the wear. Anti-creeper slippers. Someone smarter than me can make I, a joke about this. I haven't I haven't actually had problems with creepers in this mod. Yeah, me neither. It I killed one and it seemed to explode on death, weirdly enough. I wasn't sure what was going on. Machine casing. Quartz calcite shale. I might have to find some lava, actually. And just maybe go to the nether now to get quartz. 
I honestly don't know. Hmm. It. I'm actually surprised I haven't found any lava underground. I might have to mine deeper. That's the thing. But I got a black lotus. I wonder how much I can sell that for. Did I ever tell you before that my dad had one of those first edition black lotuses from Magic the Gathering and sold it to help him pay for college? I have not heard about that. Yeah, he actually did. But... He has mentioned every now and that he that he kind of wishes he had held on to it for longer because it only ever went up in price. I guess the question is how well that kept track with inflation. Hmm. It. Oh, so you're you're familiar. It. I know Jake played Magic: The Gathering every now and then. The only card game I play, and you're you're allowed to kill me for this, is the Genshin in-game trading card game which i have fun with i hate you okay good you should what's enriched iron takes but he didn't play the splatoon 3 huh. isle card game i just did not like it all that much i figured it would have taken me a was... figured it would have taken me a while to learn and i was just sort of not my problem not my problem Genshin TCG is le legitimately really, really good. It wasn't, like, great. Mm. Yuzu, have you done the challenges for this it version yet? I had more trouble than I'd like to admit with the trees the need final sunlight. challenge, the fourth one. They need light. Yeah, they don't need sunlight, they just need light. And you can also force grow them with the arsenal. Like, ball. lantern, yeah. Any light source would work. Like, you remember that underwater... Oh. At the lighthouse, not a wizard tower. Well, I didn't mean the TCG challenges in the overworld. I mean the tavern. I mean the four drums temper challenges right now. Okay. Big thing is there was another. Oh, oh, Dom. Do you want to set the amount of players who need to sleep to reset it to daytime to half of player count or something? How do I do that? Well, I'll find out and tell you then. <laughs> Okay. Uh, if, yeah, if you do that, then yes, I would want to do that. Yeah. Because I know, right at the start, when we both had to sleep to make it daytime, I was just sort of, eh, eh, that's kind of, kind of, hmm. Yeah, I... I'm gonna hem, I'm gonna hem. A hum, a hum, a hum, a hum. Although I do need it to be night, so... Oh, okay. I'm, on, I'm constantly on patrol for, uh... Would a squire or page work, too? Oh, shoot. Like, this is like an actual lighthouse. Are you in... Are you on the ocean, or...? I'm by it. Um, also, as a mod, you have the ability to just change it to daytime. Well, yeah. I was thinking, as part of one of my evil plans, making... making permanent day or permanent night, actually. Is there a way you can do that, like, in-game? Yeah, it takes Ars Nouveau for okay. one. You can make so I was gonna tablets. say, I was like, it, like, don't just use the mod power to do it. No, I would not do that. Well, to be fair, one thing is, is that Draconic Evolution actually allows you to kill players in creative. So, because it's... No, no, you can't kill players in creative, but... Actually, let me see. Okay, there was a... I think it was Extra Utilities 2. Added a weapon called the Kikoku, which is apparently the sort of Trafalgar d from One Piece or so, I've been told. That dealt void damage and therefore could be used to kill players in creative. Big thing is that Draconic Evolution, which is in this mod pack now because nothing good can last, allows you to deal... Let's just kill this guy with magic missiles. It has a boss that deals void damage, and therefore its armor also allows you to avoid void damage. So you can fight that boss, which means it can kill players in creative, and that if you wear that armor, you can literally survive falling in the void and have to take it off to not die. I mean, to not just fall forever. It depends, it depends. But the big thing is, Four Trump's temper is fun. I do that every patch. That's good stream content and also just fun. Oh, but, but the latest was... one... And they always try to incentivize Undead using new cards. Knight. 
The big Why one is recently... Name tag? It might be an apotheosis thing. Big thing is that the final challenge was sort of based around using... Hello. Oh, Hello, good. man. How you doing? Pretty good. You see that you're doing B stuff now. How is that? Uh, it's pretty fun. It's pretty fun. Nice. Um, I'm trying to make a periodic table, and uh, to do that, somehow I need to do B stuff. Is that something that is just in the mod pack, or something you're doing as a personal objective? No, it's an actual part of the mod pack. Okay. I know that alchemistry is in here, but I didn't know if it worked like that, specifically. Okay, Amplify is true. Yeah, I think it's like a mashup of some- like, the bees- the B mod pack doesn't have the periodic table, but it, like you can get hydrogen from hydrogen bees. So uh, isn't that productive like bees? A... I think. Yeah. No, that's. Bees. Oh, it is that. Okay. Well, well I'm using bees is its productive own bees. Thing too. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's time to make a better pickaxe spell. Yes. That's exciting. But I got one of those bee nests earlier, and I was just thinking. What I might want to do with that. And... Oh, interesting. But multiple amplifies on there. Huh. Oh, and it... I didn't know that Ars Nouveau... Dom and I played a lot with Ars Nouveau when we did Dawncraft. And there are a lot of things that just weren't in it because it was not a fully upgraded, updated version of Ars Nouveau. But this version shows how much mana consumption a given spell will have, which is really, really cool. So the version we had did not do that, and I ran into some consumption issues occasionally. Hmm. So that would be netherite level if I had two amplifies. Can't imagine three would ever be necessary. This should be good. So we have pickaxe here, so this will be diamond pickaxe. I I know that when we did Dawncraft and you we did Ars Nouveau Dawn, you had that Hyat spell. That was that jump one. Mm -hmm. I had that was a silly name. This time around, I've been incredibly literal with my spell naming. Uh, that checks out. Well, as a joke, more or less, because the entire deal is I named my break spell Pickaxe, and I got made a diamond pickaxe to craft the Amplify Glyph. I made an Amplified Break spell, and I just named it Diamond Pickaxe. Does that make you hate me a little? No. Okay, good. That means we're, we're still friends. But, as I was saying... So, what it, what is your end goal in this, Corinne? Right now, I want to make... That periodic table, apparently, like, it's called chem lib. Mm. Um, but they, like, connected it to the B with the thing somehow. Um, so chem lib is separate from alchemistry? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. I, would I think not I can have... do it through alchemistry as well, but I don't know. Okay. Well, it does stand to reason that the science person would be doing science stuff. Indeed. Indeed. Yeah, and the non-science person is doing magic stuff. Mm -hmm. I still stand in awe of anyone I think who... alchemistry is pretty... Like what? Oh, so um. I was gonna say the alchemistry thing sounded like kind of a mixture of chemistry and science, or... Or chemistry and magic. That's fair. You're not gonna believe it, Dom. I finally have well, animals yes, but... I can breed in this game. Good for you. No, I, just... I, got, I got two sheep and two pigs. And that just do reminds me of the... the one, one of one of our ain't teachers. Nothing but mammals, bro. One of our teachers back in high school literally said that line in class as part of his quote unquote criticism. Was that Hibsman? No, it was. Oh, that would attract. No, it was Jensen. It was Jensen. He said that? Yeah, but Jensen I... Jensen continues to be a fucking animal, dude. I love Jensen. And I, I did not recognize the reference at the time, and then years later I actually saw, you know, some of... read the lyrics of the Bad Touch. I forget why. I don't know. I guess I was on a Bloodhound Gang kick or something, but... 
I just saw that and I was like, wait, isn't that what Jensen literally said in class? It was... It felt like a bolt from the blue. Ashes and bones. Have you been doing anything with the Corel tombstone? You and me, Skills? baby, ain't nothing but mammals, so let's do it like they do on the Discovery Channel. It... You're horny now. <laughs> Hearing you say that is just so funny to me. <laughs> just, the fact... <laughs> just the fact that they say that outright is just very, very funny to me. It's just congratulations. Congratulations, I guess. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> But I feel like I feel like the Bloodhound Gang is a very dom-coded musical group. Would you agree? No. Okay. Understandable. You know, you're you're always free to disagree. Hmm. Just trying to figure out what else I can get in my cave slash mine shaft before I need to relocate myself. No. What's up? I just wanted to show you something. Okay, give me one sec. I'm gonna finish taking these three back to my base. Hi, Jake. What's he want? I'm hurt. He wanted to tell me something. Okay, can you tell Jake? I, t I told him already, but can you tell him that I'm still very steadfast in my decision to harvest his f well, he hold on to his flesh and use it for sustenance? You can tell him that he'll probably be on in a little bit. Yeah, that would be fine. Oh. I hope it comes on. It is popping tonight. Truly. Okay, well, I found lava in my cave, so I think I can make another portal now. It really does... It is kind of crazy how different the progression is in this mod pack, how much faster it is. And it's, it's literally functionally day two or day two and a half, because that one hour I spent on before it crashed the first time... And I'm already just about to hop into the nether. I know, I know, Jack, you were on. You were in the nether last time. I have every biome discovered in the nether. Oh, wow. That's nice. I was looking for a warped forest to add to my castle. Didn't even end up using it, and I ended up finding a nether fortress, two bastions, and a boss fight. Mm, if, you oh. if you found Bastion twice, how many times did you find Tracer? Yeah, oh. I never actually found that one. Okay. That's a good question. I just remember, Dom, I think you might have been there back our final year of high school. Well, because that's when you started doing Feeder How. I asked them to put on the I'm Already Tracer song for one of our sort of pre-show pre-game things. And I was just sort of skipped to this part and they just refused to do that. So it went on for a full two minutes before the meme portion came on and it was entirely blunted. You know, maybe they just hated me. I wouldn't blame them. Something like that. Something like that. Mm -hmm. I, I revel in people's hatred. Sometimes, kinda. It, at least right now. But, Jack, what are your plans here? What are your plans on the server other than building a wooden castle? I already made the castle. That's done. Oh, oh um, you did get enough nether wood for it. Yeah. Well, I didn't even end up using the nether wood. Oh, wow. What My goal using? is to learn... Well, it's eventually to just do as many mod packs as I can, but I'm going to start with Botania. Oh, nice. Good idea. Dom was telling me that he had basically told every single person who had not had experience with Botania to do Botania. That's just what I've been doing. That's fair. Or what I, how, like, yeah, the, I've right, been... Come on, <laughs> yeah. Botania Evangelist. Mm -hmm. Let's get some of this. I found my obsidian. I think it'll be time to go into the nether soon. The funny thing about it is that if anything... No, I do have flint. That's right. So how many of these are obsidian? How many of these are... Not a lot of obsidian. It... I know that you can... Since this does have Ars Nouveau in it, that there is technically a way to get infinite lava with that one. Oh, that one mod, I mean, that one source generator that can convert lava. That could be nice, but the question is just how much I would, how much lava I would need and for what. Have you played around it at all with the silent gear stuff? 
Some of the ore I found down here has been uh, sunk a eroded. little bit. It's an interesting idea, know. but it just feels like a lesser version of Tinker's Construct to me. I miss Tinker's Construct. That's sort of what it is. Yeah, I, I do too. It it is overpowered, but that's the whole point. Well, really. it, it's all right. It depends on what you mean by lesser. Um, I thought we were gonna say it depends on what you mean by it, overpowered. It isn't as cool as Tinker's Construct, in my opinion. Um, it's it's not as cool, mm. but I think technically it is a lot easier because there's just not all the setup. Oh, okay. I just I remember back when I did Tinker stuff. I played a tiny mod pack. I think I made a little mod pack for myself that was based with Tinker's construct and a Metroid mod actually. It, that was a fun mod, actually, that Metroid mod. One of the things that Metroid mod did was it made it so that if you were in the nether without the Metroid mod's armor, you would just constantly take damage. Huh. Because to reflect having... Jack, you played Super Metroid. You would understand this. I, yeah. some time ago, many years ago, I played this Metroid mod for Minecraft that made a number of changes, and one of them was making it so you needed the Metroid mod's progression in order to actually just go in the nether. Otherwise, it would be constantly on fire and taking damage, because it was just... Basically, you needed to make the various suit. And... Yes. Which, you know, it makes sense, but it's very, very funny for them to change basic game mechanics in a way that makes things harder to force to use that progression. But... Do you think you're going to play Metroid Prime? Wait, what? Yes. Oh. Huh? Stronger character. You survived one hour. Okay. All right. I don't actually know if I have that achievement because of how many times I've starved to death in this game. Fair enough. Holy cow, how many freaking zombies are there? So uh, I wonder what I picked damn. up there. That was certainly an interesting way to die. There was some kind of ore that I mined. Jack! And it just blew up and killed me. <laughs> Jack, are you in your base? I am, why? Here, come to mine real quick, please. Okay, one sec, one sec. Let me get this pig in. Okay. Once he sees what you're nope, trying nope, to show nope. him, I need to see what you're trying to show him. I accidentally punched a fox. I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, aren't you happy you stayed on then and stayed up late That's in so Italy? Ridiculous. You got to see me die like an idiot. Crimson iron and I... Oh, you're kidding. Go to what? your base. What am I yeah. looking for? Okay. okay, I'm here. I just right, went down a shaft I should not have watch gone this, down. Watch this, watch this. If I had gotten yeah. stuck, that would have been ridiculous. Watch this. Come on, come on up. And right. That was... That was my first death. After oh, well. going to my base. Oh, no. It really sucks not having any... I got tools. another ring, and watch my step height, dude. Yeah, I know, you <laughs> jumped like eight blocks in one I step. I can go up like three steps. I got... This is so dumb! <laughs> wait, wait, yeah, so how high can you go up? Hold on, let me let me test this, hold on, hold on. He's doing measurements. Okay, understandable. Okay. Uh... Oh, and I bet I could go up one higher. Yeah, there is a creeper in your base, just uh, be careful about that. Fine. Oh yeah, yeah, if you want to go into my base, feel free. Don't push your limits too far. Alright. I can go up. Hold on. 160. I can jump six blocks at a time. And how high can you step? I can also double jump to another three. Another three. Whoa! Dude, it birthed two pigs. Okay, feel free to head out. Thank Never you, mind. Thank you for no, watching. No, no, I can jump. Hold on, hold on. I can actually just do this. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Why did he birth two pigs? Can that happen in vanilla? There we go. What did I get? Stellarite oh, right. piece. That's what I died for. Oh, and there were some diamonds. Okay. You can drink right, water well, instead of monster. If I want, I can go... Who are you talking to about the monster energy? Not me, presumably. Okay. I don't drink monster energy. I've never had monster energy. I have standards. What the hell? 
A okay, skeleton riding a bee? What? Oh yeah. How, how big is the how big is the bee and how oh, big is the skeleton? What is this? Oh, I did hear about that. Somebody, somebody in. You guys teleport to my base. Okay, have fun. You'll see him. You can do a screen. I think this guy just wants us to. You go can do a space. screenshot. You can Flex. do a screenshot. That would work too. Same, same difference, right? Jumping I got twelve blocks in the air. We're, we're all cozy. This is ridiculous. Now. I guess we're all cozy now. All right, here. Let me get a running start. One sixty. I can jump up to fourteen way, blocks in the air. When it becomes night, don't skip it because I need, I need there to be. Uh, I'm trying to get another zombie villager to show up at my base. I'm doing something. Huh? <laughs> I'm working saying, on it. I'm, do I'm doing something. I'm working yeah, on basically. it. Let okay. me go. Let me go. I'm doing, I'm something. doing something. I'm doing something. Okay. 50 guys. 50 guys. 50 guys. 50. Yes. <laughs> I think oh, I'm. Oh, like, chasing me. I think I might know what you're referencing, but what are you referencing specifically? Look at this fucker. Look at this guy. I think you should leave. Oh, okay. Hold on. That it's wasn't what I. Thought. Oh. That was not what I thought. You were Hold there. on, let's see if I can 360 no scope this I've thing. Plus so much experience. Come on. Ooh, 720 no scope. So dead. So dead. Okay. Oh, what the hell is Donzoed? There was. I might have mentioned this to you, Don, but what one of the guys in the in the choir was a really big. Well, I'll be fair. A lot of people are big. I think you should leave. Guy would constantly reference it. Great job. What is this guy? Oh my goodness. I- Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Step height is, is... I have a step height at uh, What is this necromancer? Come on, you- I need to- what I is, you Those guys dead. suck. Okay, I don't have- I don't actually have a sword. I just have a harm spell. That was not a good idea. Especially since he keeps strafing. He's on strafing up- Oh, come on, you. Come on. Where did it even go? I swear to god. Come on, come on. It's actually vile. I... Yeah, it... I don't even need to be a caster, it... I could have just actually brought a sword. Nothing was stopping me other than my own stupidity and vanity. It... Uh... Or what I could do is just make a harm spell that... Oh, is a right-click harm spell? Magic sword, basically. It's actually wouldn't be a bad idea. Worked pretty well. Come on, you. Come on. And okay, now that one's dead. Where the stupid necromancer go then? I hate being a spellcaster right now. To do some iron spells and spellbooks then. Come on, die, die. Okay, and let's make a spell that's just a magic sword. It. It's an idea, but wait. That's right. I could just stack multiple harms in one slot instead of amplifying them. I guess my question is, how much damage would multiple harms do as opposed to amplifying a single harm? Amplified by the, well, we could just do a bunch amplified. Punch. Here we go. Okay, I will we'll find be back this guy. On a sec. Just kill him. One minute. Well, it'll be nice to see you again. Is did the necromancer just go away? He might have. It's not good. And that. Oh my goodness! I... Not enough mana. Okay. Okay, Jack. Oh. I, I missed. A lot of coal. Missed. Okay, cool. I missed my shot. Well, not my shot. I missed my punch. Oh come on, you! Do not kill me. Do not. If this guy kills me. I swear. This guy's probably gonna kill me, right? I think this guy's gonna kill. Oh right, it's because I can't. It takes longer to eat than I. I hate this so much. Come on, come on. There is really come on, die already. And can I Ah, stupid, stupid. If I die in combat with this stupid armored where is this guy even? I've been on the search for a deep dark biome uh, for a hot minute. Come on, just shoot and, and it will I... probably be another. Of course hot I missed, of course I, I missed. I... Damn. Is that where the warden is? That's a... An actual sword would be good. That's where the warden is. An actual sword would be good. Uh, yeah, if you find one, let me know. What are you looking for a warden for specifically? I'm I know not you... looking for the warden. I'm looking for uh, all the modium. Oh, uh, already? You have a netherite pickaxe? 
Oh no, but I could probably I probably wanted to just find a uh You do need another in order to in order to Damn. Oh, but it's in yeah. ancient cities. That makes sense. This is painful. I ah, not enough mana and finally we tap that gun to die. That was more painful than that. This trip me. has netted me a bunch of uh really good loot. I found a fortune three like gold pickaxe. So whenever I come across diamonds I'm just like yoink. I've been using Ars Nouveau to basically have an infinite pickaxe on me. That's probably the wisest idea, but um, I'm a new. I don't know. I don't know if you can mine uh, all the modium with that. Well, you can fr you can freely increase the mining level. So in theory, if it takes another right, just gotta tap slap two amplifiers on it. Should be good, in theory. Oh, Dom, I got um. I got the uh, refined storage to work, and it's so much nicer. Dude, is is it not just a lifesaver? <laughs> it's, it's it's so amazing. Yeah. That's what that's what my next goal is. Also, I have found cows and chickens. I want to see something cool. You really are just. Well, I'm taking I'm taking this white cow with me. You really are going farmer mode, huh? Oh my gosh, a bear! Can you breed bears in this game? With each other or humans? Uh, Probably. Sorry. Uh, probably, probably with each other. <laughs> Can you, as in a like an impersonal you, or you, as in like you're telling, asking if I personally also, can read it? Oh my gosh, that is a mimic loot chest swimming in the water. Let me see. Oh, uh, kill mimics. They always give like good drops, at least in my experience. Well, unfortunately, my inventory is a little full. Oh come on, where are they? Where is that guy? I'm taking I'm taking three. No guys. more amplifies, no more amplifies. It's lots of harms. Okay, that's Hey about Mr. The same. Mr. Cow, can you uh, come this way? Damage this does in comparison. Come oh strafing doesn't work. I come on. It's about the same, okay. Oh my god, the golden chicken. What do you think the chicken feels about that? Uh -huh. Let's kill this guy. About being golden. Do you think it causes self-esteem problems sometimes? No, I think I don't think so. Okay. Yeah, well, well, just imagine what it'd be like if you were a chicken, and you were only valued for for the gold you laid down. I think that could pretty quickly lead to feeling bad about Sounds yourself. Sounds like America. Mm -hmm. Big oof. It says a lot about society. They don't catch me slipping, yeah. man. It's just... Thanks, oh, I, I like that whole these. thing where it's just... This says a lot about society, and then someone responds, This says literally nothing about now society. Right click. <laughs> right click on that statue. similar to the Breath of the Wild mechanic, where you can increase your health or your uh, oh. stamina. Yeah, <laughs> there are spirit orbs in this game. Yeah. Yeah. But... Is this true? Back in mm. Dawncraft, I went... I know, I was gonna get it in a sec. And a boss would drop spirit orbs pretty reliably. And one time I just stayed on for a couple of hours just repeatedly killing one boss, because he could respawn them, to just get a bunch of spirit orbs to get both me and Dom to maximum health. Because I nice. felt like doing a nice thing for us that one time. And <laughs> now, now Dom is forever indebted to me. He owes me his firstborn. That's actually not true, though. Yeah, he owes me his secondborn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Also, actually, it's the first and a half born. We're still trying to figure out what that, that exactly work? means. <laughs> well, I don't know either. That's the problem. So, you could take that to mean the average of one and two is one and a half. So, do I give you half my first and half my second born? Yeah, it's a King think, Solomon kind of thing. I think yeah. there's equal probability of giving both one, the first born and the second born. That's how I think. It's Gasha. Baby Gasha. Who? Who's Schro that? That's Jake. Schrodinger's firstborn. That's Jake. Oh. Yo, this, this is popping it's right popping now. It's popping off. Six people. I will, I will unfortunately be hopping off in a little bit. Well, what? you're not allowed to do that. You have to stay um, on here. I'm hanging with uh, somebody. Okay, otherwise we'll eat your flesh. Oh, we did these. Mm -hmm. But either way, it was good to see you. Oh, look at that. Thanks, it's good thanks. to hop on with the boys and the Korean. Hello. 
Oh well. Oh. Uh. So how is everything going with you and Jack and all that? Oh me? Yeah, yeah. Um, pretty good. I just got a job. Oh wow! What are you up to then? Yo. Uh, I got a job as a forensic biologist at the Indiana State Forensic Lab. Actually. Oh wow! That's, that's, that's actually, that sounds rules. fun. That's pretty good. It's impressive. <laughs> pretty good. I'm yeah. Glad that one of us is a meaningful future. Yeah. How how are y'all doing? I'm doing all right. I'm living, surviving. Personally or career-wise. A little bit of column A, a little bit of column B, maybe. What the? Can be harder to distinguish the two than you might like. <laughs> what is this? What is what? Enderman head. He's you could like. You could wear it. He's following me. <laughs> he's following me. Is he now? Yeah. That's kind of sad. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think you could find anything better to do? No. Um. Maybe. It's, it's just, you know, he can literally pick up blocks and place them. He would be better off trying to build something instead of just trying to hunt down and kill people. He, he can widowy pick up box and place them. He's widowy picking up boxes right now. Widowy. I don't get it. Me neither. Sorry, you're just not that cool. There's not much to get there, Jack. I'm gonna be honest. Youch. Okay. Uh, well, I'm, I'm I'm just well, well I've real. got the cows, so... <laughs> Oh, I need 10,000 millibuckets! The, the way you said that, it was very dramatic. I need to go kill a bunch of shit. What, oh. what about mobs? That's what I mean by shit. I know. <laughs> Kid named ass. shit in the back of the class, like... <laughs> Kid named shit. <laughs> Alright, I might. Mm -hmm. I can actually technically AFK here and kid, get a lot of blood. Kid named Back of the Class. It. Who was. I, I don't. Wasn't it you, Dom, who said that somebody had the energy of someone who would name a dog Dog? Yeah, I forget <laughs> who that was about, though. Was it Thomas? <laughs> no, no, no. It was about Thomas. A dog named Dog. Do you think Thomas would name a dog dog? No. Do you think Thomas, Thomas wouldn't have a dog? Do you think Thomas would name a cat dog? Dude, that's a good show. Yeah, I was about that just fuck you. I was just about to say something. Okay, this clearly means you need to kill each other now. I am Okay, they're not following orders. I wonder what I have to do about that. Oh, I need to go kill some mobs. Yeah. I guess I'm gonna kill people around here so that way I can allow that dang time to. Dude, I hate how freaking slow animals move if they're leaded. Come on. Well, eventually you would be able to just teleport them with Ars Nouveau stuff, right? It. I, I know Dom isn't using Ars Nouveau, but the utility it provides is really, really good. I think other people would do well to avail themselves of it as well. It... Especially since it has its own separate resource, so you're not really in a problem by using it. And additionally, that most of the good spells just take standard resources. It... It's pretty decent. It's not much trouble... Oh my goodness. A random creeper just snuck up on me from chest. there? What kind of oh, and you you two have been using refined storage, right? Yes. Okay. Well, I was talking to Jack and the other Jack, and Corinne. It's based. Okay. Uh, I want to use it. I don't have it yet. Okay. Using. Um, I thought you and Dom might have been sharing more resources. Actually, interesting. No. Okay. When Dom and I did Goncraft, a lot of resources were shared. At the very least, there was a condition, a tacit understanding that if anything was really needed, we were allowed to take it. 
Well, to be fair, some of that was limited by the fact that, you know, you had to know where the thing was to find it. And okay. Jack, when you died of leukemia, were you carrying a lot mm -hmm. of uranium? Yeah, I definitely was. Okay. I'm worried then. Because I'm picking up a lot of uranium. Oh, right yeah, now. I bet that's what it is. That's what that I is what it is. Okay. Yeah, I told... Yeah, it's 100% what it is. I told him about that privately in the interest of... You know, letting other people die stupidly and impeding <laughs> their process. Because if I'm going to be the bad guy, I can't let people get too far ahead of me. Well, unless I'm willing to steal. But I can't steal right now because FTB Trump claiming is still on. So. It. So I am running into the issue of needing more mana, honestly. Because I've got a spell in Ars Nouveau that just literally works as a diamond pickaxe. But flawless a gem. Is that apotheosis? Why is it? Oh, wait. It's because it's... Yeah, because when Dom and I played Dawncraft, and this is a common thing. can't believe Jack's dead. We got a number Which... of apotheosis gems, but not all of them were all that useful. Fuck of raw uranium. Because some of them, and apparently, in this mod pack at least, I'm not sure if it's a base change to Apotheosis or an individual change, all the mods I made, I presume it's just a base change to Apotheosis, that one of the interesting gems, which allows you to do base HP damage to enemies, is when you hit an enemy, you do an added amount of damage based on their total max HP, which can allow you to bust down pretty heavy things relatively quickly is now limited only to axes, when in Dawncraft he found one of those gems, which was an Ender Search gem, apparently. Which apparently means that normally you can only find it in the end, even though that's not how it worked in Dawncraft. Because they tweaked a lot of things. You can... I, we could put it on any number of weapons. What I didn't realize is that you had to hit the thing with it. Because I tried putting it on armor to see if that would allow me to, I don't know, make things over 100%. Or deal 100% of a mob's HP and damage when just hitting it. But, apparently that's only a thing you can put on axes now. So they've done some more tweaks. Which, it does make sense to make it a weapon-only thing. Given that it actually does only work on things you hit with. So unless I took off my piece of armor and punched someone with it, it wouldn't do anything. But, it is still interesting as a balance decision. Hey, real quick, I'm gonna be hopping off. Okay, well, I'll okay. Later. okay, cool. Take your time. See Have ya. fun. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy your life. Okay. Yeah, so... I'm just looking for lava right now so I can get into the... Oh, there's a spawner there? Oh my goodness. That's kind of crazy. I... Let's stop that spawner from spawning. Yeah, because I need lava and monster box... Monster box. Oh, the monster box broke it. Oh my goodness. I was not expecting that. Oh, come on, come on. I need more magic missiles. Oh my goodness. If y'all ever happen to be in the nether and you see a nether quartz beehive. I have. Oh, yeah. Zen, get one for you? Sure. Okay. Understandable. Come on, die already. Die already. And what is this? Why is this pillager so strong? What's up with that? Okay, well, they're poisoning each other now. Come on, you. Come on, we need to. But now you're dead. Now you're dead. Good. Okay. Come on. Let's just try to kill you. Die, witch. Die, witch. Die, witch. Oh my god. Now I'm poisoned. You've got to be kidding me. I want to die down here. I want to die down here. Oh, so the, the witch is healing the remaining. That's annoying. It's really annoying. And. Okay, one of them is dead. One of them is dead. Don't harm me. Don't harm potion me. Come on, you. Come on. Oh, you got a lot of coal. Uh, you got a music disc? Interesting. But I... Uh, come on. We need... Let's go for the Dolorous Stroke. And can I... Oh, my goodness. Oh, what is up with that? I... Maybe I need to come back with a better weapon. How much is this iron knife going to do? Even. Come on. Yeah, I need to have an actual sword equipped. Can't afford to do things like this. This is so silly. So annoying. Okay. Well, that one's dead. That's good. Come on. So we can't just spam it down if I really feel like, but... Uh, 
Can't do that. Jump in the. What in the goddamn? Really? Okay. Nah. Just keep dying. It. I need to have an actual weapon on me. I. I'm in pain. I'm in severe pain. Someone needs to get Jake to hop in VC. Well, actually, they don't. It would be nice, though. Cancel the ghostly sheep. Launch of death increase. Huh. So one thing I've been doing is... Have you seen any of the upgrades you can get with Knowledge of Death in Coreal Tombstone? I have, briefly. It actually seems pretty cool. It is interesting. The big thing is that... I've been focusing on the updates, uh, the upgrades that give you more grave dust on undead kill, because it's a resource you need for anything associated with the mod. So it's just, you know, the faster you get more resources, the better. At least I presume. That's how I usually go about things: just focusing on resource acquisition. Okay, come on. Are my waypoints on death? Lux dust. Flux dust? What does that do? Got. Okay. No clue. Well, you can find out sooner or later. But I'm just trying to find my way to. There's a decent number of lava falls in my base. Well, in the mining, the big cave I've been mining in under my base. But of course, you know, I haven't found any actual lava pools. So it's still been tough hunting getting obsidian. There we go. So the witch despawned. Hope that witch hasn't despawned. I think that witch despawned. That's not good. Well, whatever. And I... <sighs> oh, my God. Guess who has a music disc now? Me. I got chirp. Bathus boots. What do I hear? Oh. A lot of stuff. Keep slicking go. We also got a name tag. That's fun. Look at that. A grave dust. Huh. Don't need that deep slate. Well, okay. No more lava, no more blood. Give me. I will say that not having. Not having any kind of base keep inventory on death. And I understand that, you know, this mod pack is not as hard as Dawncraft. That's no, I, I, I like that. You, I, I just don't like it when items can despawn or just get eviscerated. That's fair. Grape does prevent that. Yeah. yeah. Now I see. Now I see. Come on, you... Uh, what? That, that's not fun. Is he okay? No, no. You good, Jack? Well, he hasn't answered, so... I'm left to worry for the worst. Maybe he got eaten by the wolves. It... So... What is your goal here besides making a periodic table, would you say? I don't quite know yet. I'll probably do more beef stuff. Right, um, right. I'm already doing it. These it, are cool. Just need to check something real quick. And just come on, come on. Crit, crit. There we go. I know that some speedrunners use axes over swords specifically. And I wonder if that's because of the critical hit mechanics. That is exactly why. Oh, okay, well. I'm using an axe right now, and it's because of the critical hit mechanics. Oh, shit. Dead. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh, were you gone? There's spawners down here. Yeah, it was gone. It's crazy. Yeah, you died. So much crap around here. Uh, there were turkeys up in some trees outside. Hmm. In trees? Yeah, in some trees outside by my house. Die, die, die. It. Dom, do you know if. This mod pack has Spawner Decay. I looked in the Spawner Decay mod from Dawncraft in the dependencies for no, this. No, it doesn't. Okay, good. I didn't think it did, but I wanted to check. Uh, by the way... Well, actually, I don't know if I want to tell you that. You'll figure it out. Uh... 
Is this important? <laughs> Depends on what you mean by important. I think... Any future cooperation is going to be contingent on you telling me what this is. I got the impression that your intention is to get me to blow up half of my base. Break spawners. Okay. That's what I'll say. Do you get anything good from them? Oh, yeah. Okay. That's what I will say. Oh, yeah, big time. Break spawners. Interesting. Well... Probably wait a second, actually, because my inventory is pretty much full right now. Oh, this is just a dungeon. That's cool. Oh my, lots of spawners in here. Is this place so big? It... I wondered how much progress other people would have made in their time on the server, and I can't figure out whether people made more or less progress than I expected them to. Spider. Die. Die. Uh, why is... weird? Uh, there seem to be some finicky things with the hitboxes for Arsene of those spells for some reason. Don't know what specifically is up with that. It is what it is. Like I said before, there are a lot of interesting added functionalities with Arsene of spells added with some of the add-ons. I do not think so. Is Astral Sorcery in this mod pack? Astral... Oh, here's a spawner. I kind of wish Astral Sorcery was in this oh. mod pack. Okay. It... Are any of you familiar with Astral Sorcery? It's a mod I've had fun playing around with sometimes. It had some cool stuff. I was just... Wondering quickly if it was in the mod pack. I wonder if there's not. an easy way to make chunk loaders in this mod pack. I've thought about there's that. There's gotta be. Well, you can set chunks to stay loaded via FTB, FTB claims. The issue is that you've said you wanted to remove that, so... Oh, Chests have so much random crap in them. What they do. Uh, I'd get a backpack. Let's go, I do baby. have the backpack. I would love to have a backpack. The issue is... I love this FTB... Uh... I have no sources of leather right called? now. Mining, ult ultra mine, or whatever. Yeah. Guess who now owns a chunk of his own flesh? <laughs> the yeah. ultra mine feature. Okay. All right. Where uh, you? That, that thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I copy it. Yeah. So I know Dom and I are interested in the idea of eating infinite human flesh. What What does anyone? What does everyone else think about that right now? I've got a piece of my own flesh and a piece of Jake's flesh. And now that he's gone, I'm gonna go and steal an Ender Pearl from Jack. That's a bit brutal. Okay, well. Interesting. Well, Dom, um, since you told me that spawners should be broken, I don't think I'll I don't think I'll tell Jack about your perfidy. Oh shit. Just think. Down Sorry, here. is this a family-friendly stream? I don't really mind yeah. one way or another. I don't try to swear- I try not to swear myself, but I can't control the people in my chat. <laughs> so... Facts. But, Dom, Dom, I realize I was muted, but since... Since you gave me that information about spawners, I will deign to not inform Jack of your perfidy. Okay, I don't think he'd care if you did. Alright, then. So, I don't want to use my I don't, don't want to use my thing on that. You don't Otherwise, we have an issue. Your one favor to call in. Yeah. F I find it interesting that we're we're keeping track of favors like that. Then makes sense. Okay. So, it. How do spawn? Okay, how, how do spawn slime in this mod pack? I mean, slime spawn in this mod pack because I just got. A slime spawning under my base in that cave. And I'm wondering if I'm in a slime chunk or if it's just a dumb luck. I actually don't know. I think they changed the whole slime chunk mechanics anyways. So. That's fair. It. This cave system under my base just keeps going and going and going. 
I'm not complaining because it means I get to find a lot of cool stuff in it, but it's... I feel like I need waypoints or something to map it out a bit better. It's an idea. And more zombie. Great. Come on. Please, I... What? Huh? Okay. What's good, Jake? Is that armor? Oh, Jake, you're in? You see him? Hello, Jake. I stole your flash. How are you doing? Having a good day? I'm doing. Yeah. That's good. Uh, Dude, I, I I popped in the in the in the chat just to say I could probably make. Wait, I do they have the the mod with the big giant forge or whatever where you get the liquid uh, tinkers i don't think they tinkers have construct no things. tinkers con there are certain mods that are just kind of like Too not strong. necessarily even replaced with better ones but they're just outdated and they just aren't really included in a lot of other mod packs like thongcraft is one of them and i really like thongcraft but that mod is I don't want to say obsolete, but that's not really used anymore. Well, it's just because it's not really updated anymore. And also, a lot of things people liked about it got changed out in later versions for the sake of being different. Because, for example, they got rid of... They got rid of the wands, which were probably the most enjoyable part of the entire mod. Getting to make... The what? The wands. The wands and the staves. Oh, that's right. You played later versions of Thumbcraft, but... The one that most people talk oh, about... Oh, no. I, I, I remember the wands. Oh, I played that version. Okay, you played four. Because I know that they got rid of wands in 5, which is one that is in later versions of Minecraft. Why would they get rid of wands? They're like the whole thing. To be different. Well, the whole thing is really the window thing. Like the... the... Window? The, the, like, little hexagon that you, like, inspect. Oh, with. the lens, the lens. Yeah. That, that was in Thumbcraft 4 too, but... I mean, the big thing was... It was the Vs system, which in the original, ver in Thumbcraft 4 at least, you needed to use a wand to tap Vs. Which was part of why the wands were such a crucial part of the mod. And then, a lot of things in later versions were either folded into the functionality of the casting gauntlet, or just did not require wands anymore in the first place. So, it just functioned differently. Which... I see. And I liked old Thomcraft. I was talking before about how I played this mod pack called Natural Magic a while back. That had a number of... Oh my goodness. How lost am I getting? Very lost. Oh my goodness. But... Basically... My game is lagging something terrible right now. It's not good. I... Okay, now that worked. Oh my goodness. I've been cooling oh, my yeah. I've been cooling my Did you experience that lag too? Uh no. Okay, so my it must Okay, it must just be my computer then. Is I've been ex Oh, Spider Traveler's backpack. I it's been really really hot lately and I've had to cool down my computer through some really really contrived means. The big one is that I have a fan in front of my computer, and between the computer and the fan is a bucket of ice, a bowl of ice water to just... Cool. Yo! It's so wretched. It's such a silly way of doing things. But it's been working, to an extent. Okay, what's down here? It's going That's crazy, really dude. Hey, it, literally, it's just whatever works. True. Yeah. Oh yeah, but what I, what I was gonna say was oh. uh, Tinker's construct. If if that was in this mod pack, then I could literally make the lead that I make at work. That's mm. funny. You can Why, make do you, what work? Do you melt the like do you like? Oh okay. Like smelt it effectively. Yeah. Everlasting. This guy was wearing. Beef. This guy was wearing fucking. Sapphire armor. What? Huh? Not consumed when eaten. I just found a random infinite food source. What? Oh no, my pickaxe broke. Oh, it's got cooldown. Okay. 
Yeah, you can find everlasting Ooh. beef. Infinite beef. What does that mean? Well, it means that on a cooldown, because there's a cooldown to it, you can just eat the beef again. It's raw, though, so it's not all that much. But... Cook infinite it. beef. Well, you can't. You can't cook it. You can't cook it. You cannot cook it. It's a shame, you know. You can't cook infinite beef? Yeah, you just have to eat the raw that beef infinitely. That sucks. That's it's terrible. It is what it is. There's worse. Ooh, amethyst. Okay. That's an epic Arznabo moment. Let's see. Is there a way to move around budding amethyst in this mod pack? Amethyst does. Know. Fair. Well, I could make I'll, more with Alchemistry. I'll probably be head out in a minute. Fair enough. Understandable. It. Putting Amethyst. Amethyst throwing dagger for blood magic. It. It is interesting because it doesn't appear. No, there. There is Amethyst Essence for Mystical Agriculture. Okay, peak. That'll be useful. That just means that you can grow Amethyst, but you actually need to find an Amethyst to first to use it. Yeah, I have an Amethyst. Actually, four. I have a bit of Amethyst, so. Oh, alright. Yeah, I just found some in a chest. So. Slow your roll. Okay, eight Essence for 20 shards, and you can also make Calcite. Huh. An amethyst essence for amethyst seeds and a farmland essence seeds essence fertilized essence. How do I infusion crafting? Ha huh. Prudentium essence that infusion crystal Premium infusion crystal needs premium Tert tertium prudentium. Fairy infusion crystal. Fairy gemstone is disparity gemstone. Okay, I can make that. I can Pro make is one reading. Of those. I am reading. No <laughs> knowledge is power. How else am I gonna be able to catch up and then wreak havoc on everyone? Catch up, dude. You're way farther than me, guaranteed. Yeah, but I'm not as far as most other people. No, you're farther than pretty much everybody except for myself. Okay, fair. Maybe Rihanna. Well, I'm, Jack and Corinne do seem to have things. At the very least, they've gotten into Jack the Jack hasn't really done anything. Fair. Oh, God. Yeah. Dark or... So dumb. I suppose that the climax of everything, if it can be said to have a climax, will be another fight between the two of us. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Dark M? Yeah. That, will, that is what will eventually allow you to make infinite... Consumable flesh. Yo, I need this shit. That's awesome. Yeah. You well, can... that's the mod I'm doing right now, Jake. Evil craft. Mm -hmm. I have to do it eventually so I can make Jake meat. You know how it is. Dude, I I can eat myself too. You can. I got like four of them. Nice. I th I only have my flesh, but you can make it with any flesh. So, do we have any concrete plans for the weekend yet? Um, I think we're gonna do... Dom, would it be okay to crash at your place? Yeah. Because I think what we're gonna do is, it's, it's gonna be, uh, all of us fellas, and mm. then, um, uh, we're gonna go to, uh, Go do like a drive or something. Or we're gonna go to the Raskeller. Stop by the Raskeller. I'll get you free shots. Oh, oh you still have that privilege. That's good. I'm, I, I do. By the way, I did confirm. I do work outside. I don't work on Wednesday, but I do work outside at, in the on um on your birthday. So I will be in the bra house, and I will be able to get you shit. And because nobody cares. Okay, I... And if need be, I'll fucking pay for it. But nobody really gives a shit. Oh, okay. Oh, you still work there. I thought you would totally switch gears. Not yet, but I... I it's a long story. Yeah, that's... That's your business. Basically, when I got back from vacation, 
they like completely disregarded the fact that I worked there through some random schedule mess up mess ups. Mm. Um, and then just didn't they scheduled me in like some a couple of BS shifts. But we're back on track now. At least that's what it looks like. I'm getting a beer garden shift every weekend, which is all I care about. I was gonna say that sounds like constructive eviction, basically. Um, not the least true thing in the world, actually. Fair. Hmm. But I'm always gonna be treated like this, and I'm always gonna get the baby sections at Mama Corolla's if I'm not fully committed to one of them. That's fair. That if makes sense. I'm not sense. exclusively working at the Rat Skeller, they're just gonna give me. I mean, they might keep me on. We'll see. But if I'm not fully working at Corolla's anymore, then you know, I'm not gonna get the good stuff because there's yeah. al they're always gonna be like, well, I mean, you're just kind of your part time. You got your foot in. You know, you're half in, half out of a couple of different things. So. It's commitment. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I need so much more blood. Oh, you know what? I can use all of this clumped blood. I got, I got. I forgot about this. Yeah. Can I have it? 181 condensed blood. I forgot I had all this. Woo! Yeah, baby. Me when I oh, condense that's blood. That's that's not as much as I am. Oh yeah. Okay. It doesn't matter. Any condensed blood will be useful for me. Gives me 500 blood each. Oh, yeah. That's what I like to see. My one goal right now is just to... Uh, I want to do mystical agriculture stuff and after I get a storage system going, so I need to get to the nether and get some quartz real quick. That's my thing right now. What I am... I'm, I want to finish the rest of my... The, my fill my base out before I start mystical agriculture for a very specific reason. Mystical agriculture, the way to really speed up the growth of all of your crops is by placing growth accelerators. Mm. Well, growth accelerators, basically, they don't, the higher tiers of growth accelerators don't speed up the growth necessarily. They just make it so that you can reach, um, you, you, you can, it, it can speed up plants from a different reach. So the, 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 the way to do it is you have to put a growth accelerator under soil, mm. like specific soil used for mystical agriculture. And the more growth accelerators you have under a certain block of soil, the faster the crop on that block of soil will grow. So every single block needs its own growth accelerator? Yeah, so Ooh. I need like, no, it needs its own like stack, not necessarily 64, but its own stack of growth accelerators. Like, wait. And now I've got blood. I forgot about all my clumped blood. Oh, but that's an applied energistics thing, isn't it? Or... Should I destroy these re resonating crystals or leave them? Huh? Huh? Okay. I don't know. I'd leave them for now. Because it says it generates, like, RF per tick. Well, you can mine them, is the thing. But isn't RF, like, energy... Yeah, but then in theory you could place them somewhere else. And use that there instead. I don't know, it's your prerogative. Hmm. Oh, more condensed blood, I like it. What you got? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Oh, and I got a diamond site put. I did it once. Yeah, I'm gonna see if things... If I get another lag spike, I'm gonna take a break to go get another bowl of ice water. I just right. hope it stops being this hot somewhat soon I'm, I am, gonna I'm in a situation call, but I'll still be in the game that's fair right. we're gonna hop 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 off yeah all right please see y'all yeah. later yeah see ya yeah back when Dom I was telling family about the weekend's plans you know, just so they know what I'd be up to and I was under the impression because I didn't know you still worked at the first place that we'd be going to mama's and then eating there, which she she was happy because I've never actually been there. She and my dad went for an anniversary some years back. So that... So they were happy that I would get a chance to go there. But... I mean, it is what it is. It's not a big deal, obviously. 
But I know you've told me that the food there was good, right? It's excellent. Yeah, it. It's it's not all right. So here's the thing: if you're if you want Italian cuisine, like true, like actual authentic. Italian, uh, like authentic stuff, don't go to any restaurant. No restaurant is going to be able to give you what you know some Nona makes in her in the back of her kitchen, that like the like the real stuff. Whether it's just whether if it's just a bunch of random pastas or, or like a lasagna or, or any sort of chicken or like cutlets any anything like that like you're not really gonna be able to go to a, a, an Italian restaurant and get that kind of thing. However, the food at Mama Carola's while it is vaguely Italian, good. I'm just trying to set up some guiding waypoints. Diamond prints. I don't know where I can find that. Oh, hold up. How much fucking blood do I need for this? What about normal blood? Wait, where's the fuck? How does the diamond sight work? Oh, there's uh, no way. There's if no way you I'm drink not. a diamond sight potion, no, you I got the then... diamond charm. Uh, that still has a durability on it. Hmm. I just know that you can make those potion charms from Apotheosis, which is going to be nice eventually once I can make them unbreakable. Because the big one that I wanted to make was the resistance charm. Because, well that said, the question is how specifically it's going to work. Because you can also make a turtle master charm, which in exchange for slowness gives you a better res effect. What is that thing? Huh? Oh, just find. What kind of monster is that? That's something that looks kind of like a blaze, but not really. A little confused. Oh, it's dead. Okay. Hmm. Oh, did you find one of the lightning boys? I fucking hate him. No, not one of those guys. It's different. Okay, if you destroy the. Oh my god, it's a fucking zombie okay. brute. I know there were big mutant zombies in Dawncraft, which was a lot of fun considering that mutant mobs is one of the mods I had seen in various, you know, those you know popular MMOs mod showcase type videos many years ago as a kid. So it was really cool to be able to actually fight the mutant mobs myself. They were in Dawncraft, the one that Dom and I played. And it was interesting, but it the mutant zombies were honestly not all that fun to fight. To be totally honest, because they just stone bricks. The mutant zombies weren't all that fun to fight because they would revive three or so times just irrevocably, and there was no way around that. And in addition to that, they just had really, really annoying attacks. What they would knock you up into the air and do a power bomb, and it was just vile because it was really, really annoying to dodge and get hits in on them. Yeah, so it was just kind of obnoxious. They were really obnoxious. It it was interesting, but it was more interesting than fun. And the funny thing about it is that just due to the way the stamina system was set up and how it interacted with enchantments, very few weapons in the Dawncraft mod pack were actually worth using in any meaningful sense. Because near the end, Dom and I had a final fight, and I had a very DPS optimized weapon set up. And there Which was... was boring, bro. It was yeah. supposed to be a fucking wizard battle, and you were like, no, I'm gonna just punch you. You the never said game. anything about a wizard duel. Dude, you just that was like the whole premise of the fucking setting up the wizard towers. And yeah. Our... Oh, that was the whole premise. I think it's all water under the bridge now. I think what's happened is in the past, and there's no sense in fretting over it. Okay. Okay. Just want to let the people know. Okay. The truth. He dropped a lead in you. Mm -hmm. Motherfucker's carrying lead on him. You had to. It's kind of baller, actually. Not gonna lie. You had to speak out against my deceit. I suppose. Of course. Make sure Just that. Want to make sure people knew the truth. Your reputation remained unbesmirched. 
period. Whatever reputation that is. And, oh, another... Quite the renovation. Oh, a monster room. Okay, cool. so... So what? I'm gonna love it if people just give me all their condensed blood. Oh, you can just... It just gives you the spawner multiple sometimes and gives you four spirit orbs. That's yes. real nice. That's oh, like that. why I just kill spawners. I now have I have I have the max of what you can get from spirit orbs. Okay. Like I have almost I have three full bars of health, but oh, I also wow. have another almost fourth full bar of health because um because of a ring I have and also a uh like having like a for, uh, a good diet. Nice. Get, like, an extra four hearts. I found a lot of cool stuff in the chest in that monster room, too. Mm -hmm. It's... Every time I think I found everything there was to find in this cave, there's just more. It... I wonder if it's entirely vanilla generation. Like you have a really good cave? Yeah, I have a really, really nice cave. I'm happy about it. I found a Mm. That's pretty nice. That's nice. Yeah, but... The two spawners I saw before, I just... Do not see where they are now. But it's been really... Just having a Conjure Mage Light has been incredibly convenient. Oh, goodness. Okay, I got a small lag spike. I think I'll have to change out my Ice Bowl soon. The ice bowl. The ice bowl. The ice bowl. It's how I live my life now. Bowls of ice. But, among other things, I... You know, I realized, because I had totally forgotten why I started doing it, doing stuff. In the evenings instead, I mean the morning instead of evenings, which are a much more logical time slot. It's because other people were complaining. And now, for better or worse, those people are going off to college soon, so... I'll be able to do a... It's telling some people about this. Be able to have a much more sensible time slot soon. Which is nice. For me, at least. I don't think it really changes how you use your li You live their lives. You live your lives. Okay. Terrible fortress. That just reminds me of... Back when we were doing Dawncraft, I went into creative to find that nether fortress, because we just could not find one at first, and then it turned out that it was just right by our nether spawn, which was very, very funny. It... One big thing is that Cataclysm is in this mod pack too, Dom. You know, the one that had the Ignis in Dawncraft. Mm. But the big difference is that you can make various eyes to find the structures for Cataclysm. Though, to be fair, Dom did, I mean, Jack did find one of them so normally. Yeah, that eye, the Eye of Flame, you can craft it to find that blazing arena. Is that. It's not Skulk, is it? I hope that's not Skulk. Is, is Infernium useful? It's very useful for something called mystical agriculture, which pretty much allows you to make, to grow any resource in the game. Like iron, obsidian, quartz, like, oh. like, it is really good, but in order to get, like, a really good, like, nice setup going, um, it takes a bit of investment. But if you're just wanting to get a couple of blocks, um, like, I've got a little setup where I'm just growing, like, eight obsidian plants and four actual infernium essence plants um and they've been you know giving me you know no trouble at all so mm. and yeah. i am gonna want to replace all these obsidian seeds with quartz Dude, resonating crystals don't stack that's fucking off oh ew well it's because they've all got their own mdt data so. Yeah, it's bullshit though. Fuck them. Make them stack. True. Tell that to the dev. Hmm. 
axes we got. Lots of stuff. It's complicated in here. Yep. Huh? I'm talking to Dick. Oh, okay. Why would he ever do that? Because he lives here. Why would he ever do that? I got another wag spike of decent size, so I gotta... I think I also got that one, too. Oh, I, okay. I actually got it as well. Okay, so it's not me. At least not that time. Or maybe I got so much lag that it redounded onto everyone else. Maybe. Come on. Come on. Oh, and that's right, I forgot. If you hit an enemy with your Conjure Mage Light, they'll start glowing. Right? Okay. Come on, you... Ah. Please. What? What? Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Okay, die. Thanks. And, oh, zombie brute? Wait, what? Huh? Necromancer's icicle, dude. I didn't even know there was a necromancer there. Okay. Alright. Alright, alright. Uh huh. Dude, I can't mine any of this fucking ore that's on the wall because it's right next to a fucking ocean. And they'll all fucking cave in. It's Wait. Is there a cave in system? No, there's. There's a. It's just next to an ocean, mm. so. You don't every, want to flow. Every, yeah, every wall that I break, it all just flows, so I can't mind fucking any of it. Fair. I... It's crazy how huge this cave is. I'm... It's interesting. Oh, also, I went in one of those star... Stargate temples and found a good amount of stuff, so... Thank you for turning yeah. me on to that. Yours probably connected to mine. Maybe. In that case, it... I'm worried about the maintenance of my secrecy then. Yo! Dude's fucking shooting stuff at me. Oh my god, there's a lot of enemies. Hmm. Yo. Yeah, there's a caving system, alright. Interesting. Hmm. Let's go to that tombstone. Mr. Donna the Dirt Digger. One heck of a name. Wait. Okay, right there. And I... Huh. God, there's uh. so many fucking enemies. It's because I was fucking hovering around this place for so long. God damn it. Okay. Put some stuff back. How am I going to get my obsidian? It, the light overlay, have any of you done it, use the light overlay? It's Q to F7, at least for me. It's very, very useful. It just shows any points where mobs are able to spawn. The big red X on the block. Oh, th that would be useful. It's very, very useful. And a necromancer, and a zombie brute, and... Some weird eye rock. Well, that's one way to go out. Okay, I... Ooh. Come on. How did he hit their wigs specifically? Who did he just... Oh, an apotheosis mob. It's fun. Yeah, dude. Nice. One time, Dom and I were fighting a boss in Dawncraft, and one of those guys showed up and just absolutely rocked us. It was... Okay. Claudius Bloodgrier. Oh, yeah. You remember that, that guy? so obnoxious. And he actually killed the boss. <laughs> that was the craziest part. Yeah, and we didn't get the drop from him. No, we did get the drop. I was just under oh. an incorrect impression on what we needed to bring back as proof. Because I thought we needed... I thought the Goblin King would drop an eye, but you actually just needed the crown as proof. So... Mm. I was just... I was just wrong. That's what was going on. As as usual. Lodestone. 
vines. Well, toss that. Break this. What was that button you said, Brendan? It was F7. Oh, Shimmer. that's so useful. Yeah. Disabled enchantment that does nothing. Oh, an iron axe. Huh. Shimmer. Ensorcelation. Take this iron. I'm just trying to find a place to... Hmm. Rotten flesh can go. I'm just trying to find a place to harvest obsidian. Cause... Farm it, dude. Well, it... I'm looking for lava. Don't have a good source of lava right now. Hmm. Oh, well, hello there. Not good. Come on, come on. Uh, magic missile, magic missile. Oh my goodness. The stupid idol on Wraith got me. Die, die, die. Oh my goodness. That's not a great way to go out. Come on, you. Die, die. Don't have my axe in my inventory right now. Come on, stay away, stay away. It. I gotta see what it takes to craft high level glyphs in Ars Nouveau in this mod pack, too. I'm fighting for my life. I'm fighting for my fucking life. <laughs> my goodness. Uranium site. Interesting. You ever just see uranium? So your mom's uranium. I don't think that's nice. how that works. Got him. I don't think that makes any sense. I think it did. Well, you know, that's... I don't know. I don't know what to say to that. I just found it unpleasant. All right. Mm hmm. In. What? 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 Sure. More of that? More of that? Okay. Well, I could have tapped out pretty easy. And, oh, we got another one of those hearts. It, I need to make a backpack, but I literally don't have leather. <laughs> it's the silliest thing. Dude, backpacks are so useful. Yeah, but I don't... Have, I use them very, very heavily in Dawncraft. But I just don't have leather right now. There are no cows anywhere near me. It's not that I see. I mean, I guess I could go back to spawn and... How do I make cow seeds? Cow seeds come from leather. Okay. Fusion, Prudentium. Oh, cow soul jar. Huh. Dude, we use niter at work. That's fucking wild. Nice. Soul extraction. Soul extractor. Operation fuel usage. Solium ingot machine frame. Solium dagger. Solium prosperity ingot. Solium dust. How do you. Huh? Oh, solium ore? Hey. It's gonna be funky. funky. I'm just confused. Brass monkey. Time to get funky, funky. It. I, f I feel like all of us are the target audience for the Beastie Boys. That wasn't Beastie Boys. That was fucking, uh. Well, I was just thinking of. The Wraith Heart. Thinking of Brass Monkey. A funky monkey. Can't believe I haven't found diamonds yet. It maybe this game just hates you. Worth considering. Probably. Yeah. It so much down here. Or even Uh oh. Where did that one? Is that a me lag spike or an everybody lag spike? I think that was a you lag spike. Damn it. Yeah. Fun mod pack, though. Oh, man, I hope I don't die. Oh, man, I hope he doesn't die. Reaper, oh, man. 
I, know, I mentioned this before, though I'm not sure. I know I mentioned it to Dom, but there's this one time near the end of college where I got all the guys in the choir to sing. We were at one of our parties, and I got every, a lot of the guys to sing the Minecraft version of got them to sing Revenge instead of DJ's, DJ got us fallen in love. I was proud Better of song, not gonna lie. Literally. I was, I was proud of myself. It was actually one of my finer moments. Good for you. Thank you. I'm actually pleasantly surprised they didn't call me a clown for that. Maybe you just thought it. Maybe. Silently backbiting. Oh shit, a zombie. Oh shit, a zombie. Oh, zom game. oh zombie, a shit. No. Oh my god, my game came back right at the last second. Lucky guy. Yo! Ooh, ooh. In the clutch. You know, you know, in the clutch, I'll say. In the clutch. Oh, okay. That's, you're gonna say that? Understand. Yeah, I'll say it. Okay, okay. What's the difference between this and a crystal? Oh, that's, that requires a diamond pickaxe. Does it now? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hmm. I found X a big lava pool. That's nice. Now, I have an artifact on right now on my foot slot that just completely negates all fall damage. <laughs> it's so nice. I have the. You know, I should put that one on. I don't know why I have the one. The bunny slippers? Yeah, I have the rooted boots on right now. Slowly replenishes hunger while walking on grass. Mm. But the bunny bunny slippers are more useful in the cave. That's fair. Wait, was the deal on grass? Re replenishes. <laughs> oh, okay. Excuse me. Yeah. Oh, you may as well. Jump boost. Oh, nice. Mm. Me too. Okay. Crying obsidian. I see a spawner. It. I really need a backpack. It's just. Dude, I don't know how you're operating without it. I don't. Really Bad luck. Either. I'm. I'm not really operating. Is the thing. Uh, just wait for uh, wandering villagers. Mm, and okay. Then, and then kill their llamas. Uh, okay. And they'll give you leather. Logical. Blaze of its rod. It. Hmm. Main thing is, I'm in a position to harvest the obsidian I need, so. Then I can go in the nether just to get the quartz I need <laughs> to actually make my storage system. Dude, jump boost is so nice. Yeah, I feel like I've been in such a weird progression route here. Because. Oh, come on. I did not mean to. Damn, damn, damn. You organize my stupid inventory fast enough. Come on, you. Die, 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 die. Bone Crusher? Bone Crusher? It'll level 50 undead creatures. That's fun. Here we go. Special items on the undead. It's enjoyable. Huh. It's just. What can I afford to part with right now? Bones can go. A bundle? Huh. I got a bunch of those. I have no idea what they do. They can be used to store things. Yeah, I, I have no idea what they do either. How my bundle slow? Uh huh. Okay, cool. It's hundred cloth. It, it looks things. like they store things, but I don't understand how to use them. I think you, you right click with a number of items in your hand on them, if I recall correctly. I may- I might not recall correctly. Maybe. Hmm. Right click on the grave soul to enchant the bundle. But what does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> I'm also in the dark here. Well, guess what time it is. It's time to get obsidian and go to the nether. It's time to get funky, funky. It might be. Darkstone. Finally, obsidian. Yay. Is what can crying? I put it with? 
I think we're all crying now. Weeping obsidian. Sobbing even. I wept your mom's obsidian. Just Se saying. Seething obsidian. It having Shit. break with amplify is so good just to break obsidian quickly. 10x obsidian. Come on. Not enough mana. Right, okay. Got 16, which is more than enough. You know, why not get a stack? What do you say? Glowing calamari. Is it tasty? I don't know. Oh, okay. Aw. Let's have to pick some of these up. Come on. The inf... The everlasting beef is actually really, really nice to have. Even if it doesn't What's replenish. That, the item, the infinite food hunger thing called. What is that called? The, it is. It's late game though. It is late game. Uh, Dawncraft or uh, Evilcraft. Damn. That's what I'm. Where I'm getting that right now. That's and also it's also not technically infinite. You still need a food. You you still need blood to power it, which is a resource you get through Evilcraft. Evilcraft. But you power yourself with blood. Or you, it's a food source that you power with, that you get via blood. It's a simple. And it, it is like I'm work, I'm working towards it. I don't even know. There's a certain resource called Garbonia, I think it's called, to, that you have to get in order to craft it. Um, but in order to do that, you need something called, um, a vengeance spirit, which you get, or a vengeance es essence, which you get by killing vengeance spirits, which spawn after Certain you kill enemies now. and you've started evil craft. Um, so how do you actually hit those things? Because I've seen some spawn. I don't know. That's the that's what I was gonna say. Mm. That I, I just straight up have yet to actually been able to damage one. Interesting. And I've looked through the mod. I don't know what the deal is, honestly. Fair. It might be some weird kind of enchantment, honestly. It is possible. Yeah. Well, a certain somebody is ready to go mine for quartz in the Nether now. Yo, I could actually use that. I'm looking for the uh, iron quartz, mm. quartz iron or whatever. Oh, for the storage. Quartz enriched iron. Yeah. That is exactly what I'm doing. Yeah, do. all you need is iron and nether quartz. Well, all you need is love. Da 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 da. Okay. How much to upgrade the spellbook to? Book. Oh, shit. Where did I... oh, you can actually make the creative spellbook in Ars Nouveau in this mod pack. You need an ATM star, though. Oh, you can even make a creative source jar with an ATM star. Yeah, this, what I think is cool about this mod pack is that there's like two, three stages to it. First stage is like beat vanilla with a bunch of various stuff. Second stage is beat like the final bosses and and of like that of like the modded stuff so post game or post um post vanilla yeah defeat all the mods post um post punk uh no it but after then there are th those are the first two phases the third phase is all creative shit so it's like, oh yeah, once you get ATM stars, which you do by doing all of these different mods and combining a bunch of shit. Once you get that, um, actually, you can just do creative stuff. It's actually kind of cool. I am excited for that. The level of shenanigans I would be able to get up to is rather high. But that is so far down the line. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, what? now that I have obsidian, it's time to actually craft a flint and steel. I'm not even sure. Okay, I have exactly two flint. Okay. Mm. 
it is interesting, because presumably I'm not really going to have to go through all the mods. Nine. But. Look at all that. This guy's getting a, achievements up the wazoo. Where is the wazoo? Up. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Iron, flint, and steel. Gimme. Give Gimme give that. Okay. Gimme that. Gimme that. I should have got that. I should have got that. Smithing table. Free smithing table. Hell yeah. Who's Smith? Did I, did I tell you, Jake, did I tell you that my sisters quoted that to me when we were on vacation? And I about lost my mind. Give me that. She told me that on vacation. I was like, what? No way you've watched that show. And she's like, what show? If she, that just was... seen, she had just seen the clip. Mm -hmm. So when did you have your mind then? What's up? If that's when you lost your mind, when did you have it? Before I lost it. Oh, well, nice. that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what kind of answer... Have it, ass. <laughs> I don't know what kind of answer <laughs> I was expecting. <laughs> stupid questions receive stupid answers. Yeah. This is actually not as slow as I thought it'd be. Mm -hmm. I just needed to upgrade my thing. Your thingy. There we go. And then go into here. I got another 12 grand! Look nice. at that! I got a dra traveler's backpack. I, but I've already got a backpack. What's the difference? Wait, can you store multiple backpacks? Eventually, there's an Inception upgrade that lets you store backpacks in yeah, backpacks. Yeah, you can, you can put backpacks in there. Eventually. But my favorite upgrade is something called the stack upgrade, where you can just... Compress? Um, you can press... Like, you can store multiple stacks of things in the same cell. But you know what? I think I'm actually going to craft that real quick. Fair. Although, I don't know if I have whatever nine times... What does the Traveler's Backpack do? I have 72 diamonds, actually. Nine, I can do it. Nine times what? What does the Traveler's Backpack eight. do? Nine, to nine times eight, yeah, 72. What are you talking about, Jake? I just got a standard Traveler's Backpack. And I don't know what it does. Mm. There we go. We did it. Oh, Soliamore's in the nether. Okay. Huh. Makes sense. I... Hmm. You know what? This is interesting. Hmm. Let's break that. Thanks. Here we go. We got our Solium. Wall huh. of Fire Scroll. Nice. What's a fire wall of fire scroll? You What's make an entire lexica, wall out of fire scrolls? Lexica Botania. Yeah, it's the Botania. That book. is the book that starts Botania. That'll start you under the Botania thing. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, another quartz or okay. In our ingot. I literally just came here to get nether quartz and dip. <laughs> It. The big idea is. Uh yeah. By the way, um, mystical agriculture is so good that it eventually gets to a point where you can grow dragon eggs and nether star seeds. Bro. Or dragon eggs and nether stars. Yeah. It's like ridiculous. It's exciting. Slain by Hoglin. Ouch. Huh. Hellhounds. Hmm. I do not want to agitate these guys. What if I... Hellhounds are going to be aggressive. Yeah. The foxhounds. Foxhounds. Oh my goodness. Okay. Die. Die. Big thing is... Not attacking me right now. Dude, That's purple drink. Benito, I just found purple drink. Purple drink exists in this mod pack. It, it does. What does it do? 
I don't know. I haven't had it yet. That sounds dangerous and frightening. <laughs> Will it turn you purple? I don't know yet. Well, I, I guess there's one way to find out. This guy's Silver. making me do drugs. Yeah. Let's get that Graceful crystal. Graceful iron sword of domain attack. Plus 15%. Dude, this sword's actually really good. Oh, nice. Me too. She says to your lesbian, go me too. You would sing that. Ironically. I hate Drick. Me hate too. Him. Me too. I never said he was singing it ironically. Me too. Crimson Iron. Pussy. What a pussy, dude. Nether gold, zinc nether ore. All right, time to go into a mine. Away. What about a yours? Die. Eventually. Jake, are you anywhere near a mine right now? Me. Mm-hmm. Like one that isn't dog shit. I'm in a good one. Right now, actually. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna teleport here and take all my shit. No, I, I am only looking for a couple of specific things. Um, none of which you really want. I I'm want look dark gems. I want inferium. Here, I sent you a request. I'm looking for blaze rods. You to figure out where I can find some. It. Watch out. Jack K was able to find a nether fortress, but I'm wondering Next to if I could find mine. Three, two, Next one. to a what? Next to a hill, don't move. Okay. Oh, it doesn't matter. Whee! Hmm. Oh, you got a fucking thing. Umbrella! Yup. You have umbrellas? Oh, dude. Look at this, dude. Let me just show you something real quick. Watch this, watch this. Hold on. Watch this. Jack doesn't like to admit that he's impressed because it makes him feel weak and small. <laughs> Where? What? Here, watch this. Or not this, but watch this. Are you watching me? Yeah. Bro, what the fuck? Dude, I need that. Give it me is that. a. Give me that. Uh, it's a combination of a bunch of stuff from Evil Craft. So if I go into my thing here. There's an effortless ring, which increases my step height, and it lets me walk faster. I found this cloud in a bottle from a mimic. Uh, it dropped it, which allows me to double jump. Um, I have you know, Brazilians these running can shoes, jump. also which I got from a mimic, which increase my movement speed while sprinting and increase my step height when I'm sprinting. So I've got two things that increase my step height, Two things that increase my movement speed, and t and something that allows me to double jump. I also get some something through Evil Craft again. Got something called a Vengeance Ring, which allows me to move. It gives me a certain amount. Of, it gives me some certain enchantments. It gives me Jump Boost three, Haste two, and Speed two. Maybe. So when I have this thing, I'm moving at like sixty percent. This is me walking. This is, me, this is me sprinting. Uh, Maybe instead of so a when final I activate jewel. the ring, I can I can double jump. Um, I don't know. It's just it's goaded. Maybe instead of a final duel, we just play basketball. I think I might have to keep these bunny hoppers on. They have been really really useful for me. What? Bunny hop, the bunny slippers. You got bunny immunity. slippers? It grants immunity to fall damage and it gives you permanent jump boost. It's real. That really is nice. awesome. Yeah, so that's one of the things. Those are like some of the things. I like the speed. So I have that, but that also seems really good. I am speed. I also just don't need the jump boost or the fall thing because I have right. this umbrella. I forget where I got this umbrella, but it slows my fall when held. Mm. So I. It just gives me slow fall, and I don't need to That's worry about falling off cliffs. Even if someone pushes you. 
wrecked. Jake, if you notice any dark gems about, I would oh, love it. Do you want me to give you some? Yeah, if you can. If you'd be willing. I don't know how many I should keep. Uh, the on they're only used for evil craft. So unless you're planning on doing evil craft, at least soon. They should add a neutral craft. But once... Let's put it this way. You give me all the ones you find, and when... Oh, nice. Um, eventually, when you... Um, here, let me actually switch backpacks. Um, this motherfucker's got multiple backpacks. Why don't oh. let him... This is the kind of greed they talk about in the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen those? No. Okay. It's a joke people make. Um, if you allow me this, Jake, then I will give you, whenever you start Eaglecraft and want to mine a bunch of shit, or even before then, um, I'll give you a pickaxe that has very low durability, like only 150, but it gives you Fortune 5. Fortune 5? Yeah. That's one yeah. of the ones I have on right now. So if you give me all the dark gems you have, and your condensed blood. This is a cool-ass cave, dude. These Traveler backpacks are simply not good. That's sad. Yeah, the, the regular, sophisticated backpacks are just so much better. So much better. Have you dropped a bundle? Thorium. I still haven't, I, I still don't know what thorium is used for. I think it's for reactors. Is it? I think. Yeah, you can make a radioactive thorium. It's actually for create a new age. So create is... Make iron nuggets radioactive thorium. And if you crush thorium, you can make radioactive thorium and iron nuggets. And that's the only way you can get it, and oh, presumably... No. Where are you at? I'm in the room with all the loot chests. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. And you can make you can make a nuclear reactor using create using nuclear fuel from thorium. Uh I, one of my favorite mods has always been big reactors. What about just medium reactors? What about average reactors? Not. Sad. Where did they go? Oh, 37 dark gems. What was the other one you needed? Oh, thank you. Any condensed blood, so all the... Mm. Oh, my condensed blood's at home. Uh, Infernium Essence, there's 51. Make a big blood. Oh, test. shit, Infernium Essence too? Oh, you're a dog. Dude, what you said browns? you're giving me Fortune 5. I think that's warranted. Yeah, I'll, I can give you a Fortune 5 pick. I don't, Again, I don't if ability is really low, but tell me when you want it and I can get it to you. Dude, I'll just get it. Iron. Silicon. Um... Quartz dust. Uh, what type of pickaxe is it? Uh, okay, quartz dust. Uh, it'll. I know it mines diamonds. Because I've used it on diamonds. Oh, shit, my Dude, like, take this pickaxe, go diamond mining. You'll get, like, fucking five stacks with the diamond sight. This controller is gonna be sun. Mm -hmm. I need more chess. Thank you for telling me about that storage mod, because I would otherwise be in dire straits. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's it's not even about me telling you. It's about just looking at the mods list. Yeah. Well. I'm more of a magic mod guy, so... What's iron Dom, do you have stone? diamonds on you? Is that too much to ask for diamonds? Uh, it's not on me, but no, it's absolutely not too much to ask. How many do you want? I, I just want to make a diamond backpack. And I'll Eight pay diamonds? Back. Easy. No, don't pay me back. Eight diamonds? Fucking take them. I'm rich. Oh, fuck. Like that one... Like, like, dude, get a, get a diamond, get, like, use diamond sight. Oh, there we go, dark core. Um. 
So Use that... Diamond Sight. Like, it, it, it's busted, dude. Diamond dude, Sight with its fortune pickaxe. What is this, dude? So, have any of you found Boises yet? Yes, I have, but... Okay. Not sharing. <laughs> well, I also... It's just going in the nether. Yeah. I think what helped me as a tip, stay near a higher elevation. Um, Something I noticed. <laughs> Help. I got you. Surbinding. A lot of interesting things I've got to be crafting right now. Mm. You got him. Got the... Good thing I've got a slime nice. ball. Jesus. It's my string. Thanks, dude. Hemp fiber? <laughs> no problem. There's a fucking, uh... Hemp fiber. Necromancer. Can't make string with that. I just have normal string. You got them uh, diamonds on you? Not on me, but I can okay. get them to you later. These diamonds are off him. My mom! My mom. Why isn't this backpack picking up on him? It hates you, clearly. Vengeance spirit? Uh, it's gonna be so nice to get so storage much more in here. Experiment. Storage in here. I made a rice cooker. I don't. Oh, actually, Brennan, if what? you do something for me, I will be very much indebted to you. What do you need? Try and kill one of the inferior, one of the uh, vengeance spirits that you find. Okay. With an Ars Nouveau spell. Oh, okay. See if they're weak to magic damage. Yeah. Next, next time I find one, I'll try that. And if you're able to, and give me the drop you get from it, which is like this crushed thing, uh, I will be forever in your debt. Okay. Oh, here's some of that. Silicon. Surtis Quartz Crystal. Hmm. Dimensional shard or Budding I'll tell you this, Jake, if while while I'm here before my pickaxe runs out, if you find diamonds, I will mine this for you with this fortune five. Hmm. Whoop. Meteor limp barrel. Sort of Dude, my inventory is fucking bulging. Uh, I haven't even been here that long. If you picked up and move spatial storage cut and paste. Crafted. Meteorites. It's team crafted. Hmm. Trying to find. Hmm. Hmm. Spatial storage. Huh. Swapping your volumes. That's funky. Okay. Ooh. Silicon. Silicon essence. What the hell is with all these rails? Mm. Manufacturer Jesus. tracks made of regular rails. Manufacturer tracks made of regular. Surtis quartz of dust. Quartz of dust. Something is. Hey. Okay, come on. I'm getting all these bundles, but... Let's see. Oh, Jake, want this Fortune 2 golden pick? Vengeance Spirit. That I just I'll found. It. And. It won't be my end game pick, but it'll no, be. No, of course not. Here is the Vengeance Spirit. It does not appear that Ars Nouveau spells can hit it. So. It was an oh, interesting it idea. It cannot. Not All an right, option, I have seems. no idea how to kill them then. Yeah. It's frightening. Wait, so how do you get your Surtis Quartz? You find them mostly in... Meteorites. Yes. Hmm, well... 
I wonder how I'm going to find one There are also else. things in meteorites that can spawn quartz. If you the just budding like surface. Yeah. It's like amethyst. Yes, it is. So if you already know all this, why are you asking? Well, because I wanted to know if you had a better way, if you had something you were willing to part with. No. Okay. I actually just see. Got a lot of crap. I'm an axe. You know, I really don't need chainmail chest plates. You really don't. Do you want them, though? I'm assuming that's also a no. I mean, I've got them, so... You'll take what you have. Okay. Or hammer. Can I make dust? Man, I'm gonna have to call it here. Because I can't... I oh, it's 10 o'clock already. There. Well, that too. But Don't drive uh, yourself I crazy. And I can't make quartz dust from... A crusher makes quartz dust. That... Hmm. Dust quartz... Hmm. Really is just certus and only certus. That hurts. Ah, huh. Pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie. I guess I just need to make more storage. But is there any good way to locate meteorites? Not that I know. Okay. Meteorite compass. Okay. Turns over. Charger, normal compass, wooden crank, mysterious cube, nearest meteorite, creature should make, box of gold, wooden crank, that's fun, early game struggles, six and a copper ingot, hit, mm -hmm. how much copper do I have, it's all raw right now, okay. Huh. It. I'm dealing with so much jank right now. This is hilarious. I'm going to need to find a meteorite soon. Oh. Hammer a bit more of that, actually. Okay. That so what have you been doing for ore doubling? Uh, there's a hammer and you can turn it into dust. Yeah, I've been using the ore hammer too. That's the most basic way to do it, so. There are a lot of other mods that do that too, but... Before I get any into any of that, I just need more storage. Yo, when you eat new stuff, you get more hearts. Yeah. That's fucking awesome. Dietary diversity. Sell your material magic armor. Hmm. I'm gonna I'm gonna eat the purple drink next. Is that really such a good idea? It's probably you okay. Can, you can get luck. What does luck do? I think it increased chest drops among other things. Right, we got a wooden crank. Come on. I, oh, you put it on a machine, I think. Oh, it's got sockets, too. Wait. In a... Charger. What's a charger take? Charger. Charger. Just iron and copper. Oh, That's nice. It, man. What happened? I just don't want to keep aggroing these zombies. Mm-hmm. Because I'm invisible, but if I get too close to them, 
they see me. Mm. Run this way. There we go. It's just that A two thing is cool, but I'm going off in a sort of weird direction just to make it work. What do you say? When you socket things, can you take the gems out? It destroys them, but yes. So I can't. You can either keep the item or keep the gems. Alright, I'm ready. Alright, I have so much stuff to dump in my chest. And I don't know it's... if I see anything else immediately that pops out. Mm. Actually, I will grab this iron. Yeah, I was running low on iron. Now I should not be running low on iron. I have a fuck ton. Magic or Imperial? Yes. Oh, okay. Understandable. Hmm. More iron. Oh, you can just right click in an inventory to take half no no to equip an item that i think is a vanilla thing yeah I'm pretty as sure. long as it's in your it, when it's in your hot bar you can no, just not in your hand in an, in a chest you can equip something just by right clicking it oh interesting uh -huh. i didn't know that was a thing yeah that all that also might be vanilla but i didn't know that yeah Iron and no, that's quartz and enriched iron. What do I? Oh, Do durability left on this thing. Let's make the most of it. On what? This Fortune Five pick. Mm. If you had silent gear, if you put it in your inventory by itself and turn it into a silent gear thing, will that get rid of the enchant? You can't. It's a special thing from. Um. Evil craft. Like oh, it's okay. not an actual. It's like its own thing. I don't okay. even know if you can enchant it. Huh. It's weird. Okay. Uh oh, game's lagging. Mine is not. Maybe it's a personal thing connected to the server, but not the computer. As weird as that sounds. Alright. It's charging time. Charging time. Open up the doors and let yourself into the world. Okay. Where that ends. Uh, it's so much iron. Not to make a compass. Our cake doesn't count as fucking new food. Cake isn't food. Cake is it's poison. Make more ore hammers. Oh, whatever. All right. Well, I just got a fuck ton of things. What do you got? Well, let's see. Hold on. Thought we were gonna say none of your business. Well, no thanks to you. I'm gonna find a meteorite and get myself some quartz. I need my redstone. Let's do that then. Redstone and. Oh, I'm getting lagged, that's why. And gets. Okay. Charge this bad boy up. Store up. Let's turn this compass into another kind of compass. Oh my goodness. Lord Larry left the game. That's sad. Wait, can you charge up the meteorite compass to... Meteorite compass to... Flawless and... Huh. Flawless. What if I regenerate using charge quartz and water? Huh. 
going? Ever decay is only be found in meteorites. Meteorite hunter. And okay, it's over there. Anyone feel like sleeping? Uh, I am not near a bed. Brutal. Really got to figure out what that toggle is. Whatever. Your wrist meteorite is over that way. Okay. Camera's kind of weird there. I need to make a boat. Hmm. I should take this smoker with me. I hardly know her. With me. Did Dom just leave? I... He's back. Now he left. Are you in a position to sleep or... No. Okay. Okay. Uh, I just need a platinum ore. Come on. Sad. Not well, I don't even have a fucking pick to... Block of raw platinum. Nice. Okay. Platinum's gotta be good. Oh, I can make a mahogany boat. I can make a pink boat. That's fun. Jake, have you seen anything about the new Zelda game yet? What new Zelda game? Zelda featuring Zelda. Echoes of Wisdom. Withered away? That's sad. Tragic. Really is, though. Oh, huh. Well, that just... It's the top of there. Huh. Well. I do not have enough inventory. Mm. This pisses me off. Better than pissing you on. Better, better to be pissed off than to be pissed on. True. It is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I and this is beating a big dead horse, but you're nowhere near a bed. Um I just need to fucking call it. Okay. Just Cause there's there's way too much here f that I haven't gotten. Mm. Ugh. Troy. Yeah, you know what? You know what? I marked it on my map already. Okay. So. Understandable. Wait, isn't he gone? Algernon Asparagus. Oh, he's on two. Right, right. How about how about he hops into bed? How about that? That would be nice. Let me know if we sleep, cause I'm grabbing a. Yeah. Doesn't seem like it. That's it. Okay, now he's gone. He's gone. So you can sleep. Okay, I was already in. Okay, there we go. Okay, cool. Meteorite Bumpus. Alright, time for Surtis Quartz. Are you mm -hmm. still streaming? Yeah, why? I was just wondering. Yeah, yeah. Whenever I'm on, I'm doing it. It's gotten a bit late for the Italians who watch me, but. Yeah. Dude, ooh, ooh. Italian. Mid, incredibly mid song. Oh my goodness, you. Uh, this stupid necromancer. Kill this guy already. I cannot. Oh my, what? Die, die. Oh, what? Please, please. No, they can't even hit their own enemies. Is, uh, well, now you're dead. He is dead now. That's good. Cannot. Mm, summon dead and. So eventually it'll disappear. Eventually. Uh, I, oh my goodness. Come on. 
my back up against the wall. I, uh, I, range on this is really, really bad. Come on. Come on. Okay. Oh, what? What? Ah. Uh, come on. I should just be magic missile again. Yeah, yeah. Okay, die, 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 die. die. Necromancers are interesting monsters, but... Okay, so they don't drop anything normally, but they can drop Inferidium Essence and Grave Dust. Huh. Coral Tombstone, kill undead mobs. Get Grave Dust. Sense of Undeath. Okay. Then Graves, two marble colors, six different styles. Three minutes after. Have his place for previous souls. Use a new soul spawn. Oh, so I can just do that now. Presumably. Let's see. Equip chip slipstream gem. Hmm. Not a Namakar. Graves dust. Need essence of undeath. Okay. Hmm. To wait then. My everlasting beef is carrying me. I wish, dude. Yeah. Well, one might even say that Dom and I have everlasting beef. How do I hear? Her? What's that noise? So that Dom's roommate. Someone is just yapping. What's up? Someone said 420 no scope. Oh, that was no 720 no scope. I was watching a clip. I, how you could hear that is wild. Sensitive I was microphone. A clip of what I took, yeah. You took in what? Oh, I, I took a clip earlier of me killing the skeleton that was on a B. Oh, oh, nice. That's fun. Did you send in the server? Not yet. Okay, okay. I'm gonna find my way to that meteorite compass. I mean, I'm gonna find myself a meteorite because I got a meteorite compass. Botania. Bobania. I met a pink boat, too. Pink boat. Pink boat. Oh, that's interesting, though. I cannot actually see. Wild rice. Crops of the wild. Four new crops, wild climates, or a chest somewhere. That's... Are there four kinds of rice in this mod pack? It's actually insane. So what's that? What is that? Some sort of obelisk out in the ocean. Found a ship? That's fun. This is... Wait. Oh, I found oil. Huh. Don't float in oil? Or... Oh, it's separate from the water. That's interesting, then. Let's mark that. And... Oh, see the compass. It's a tiny bit... I'm there. It appears I'm actually closer than I thought then. But. Mark that. Okay. So, did you just randomly find the meteorite yourself, Dom? Yeah, because there was one right outside Rihanna's base. Ah. Uh, like, hey, here's this meteorite. That's cool. Lucky man. Yeah, I had to make a meteorite compass, and I'm setting off on the boat. The annoying thing is that while you're in the boat, you cannot actually see the meteorite compass in first-person view. Oh, wait. It's close. Is it underwater? I think it's underwater. It's interesting. 
It's gonna be really painful to use the machine. That's it. Wait. So where? Where is it? Huh. Circling around it? How big is this thing? I wait. Weird location. Don't have aquatic. Don't even think. I don't even know if Arznebo is water breathing in this. Which is mod pack and okay, I'm over it then. Okay. Alright. Let's be right here. Come on. Okay. Which means night vision potion. Find myself a Oh, it's all sand, though. That's not good. Hmm. If it's... If it starts spinning around, then yeah, it must be right over it. My meteorite is underwater. Because this game hates me. Yeah. Alright. Go down and try to break this stupid thing. And we got Jasper and... Hmm. Please, please let me find a pocket of air and there we go, found a pocket of air. How much deeper is this thing? Huh. I, I learned know. recently that if you want to troubleshoot your computer, don't turn it off and on again, restart it. Apparently there's a difference. Something hmm. has to do with like its heat memory. Whereas restarting it will completely like reboot it and clear it out. Whereas mm. shutting it down tends to keep things at the same state they were when you when you shut it down. Interesting. I'll have to keep that in mind for the future. That's sort of a something. I mean I don't know how to I can't confirm or deny that and I don't know enough to dispute it, but I've been doing it ever since. Fair. And it's worked, so it sounds like it makes sense. Yeah, it does. It does sound about right. Yeah. Right. I think I'm it. Okay, fair. All right, brother. It's good Start to see you. Man. Keep us yeah. uh, updated about um, Saturday. I know I'll be. You come over to the Rat Skull. I'll get you a free drink. Um, whatever you want, whether it's shots, a beer, both. Fucking Rat Skull doesn't care if I steal from him, anyways. Um, Brutal. Well, doesn't everyone steal it from it? Is, the thing is, it is a cover to get in. Um, What's the cover? Like how much? It, it's, it's pretty, it's like 20 bucks. Damn. But, uh, it's because they have live music and Dan wants to listen to people. I'm going to ask what the time is that you can come on Saturday to not receive a cover. But if it's before, I only go in at three, and three might be too late. Mm. Three a.m. Yeah. Fuck no. Or you could just not go into the beer garden. Come in and er come in earlier at like. No, at three p.m. Three p.m. Oh okay. Food would be you nice could too. Just not go to the beer or come in at like 30 p.m. and then or you just stay around. Or whenever, whenever I'm not busy, but I won't be able to get you like shots or anything. I'd have to just. Walk. I wouldn't be able to like get all of you something. I, I just, I'd just go up to Mike and ask him to get some from his part, and he'd be cool. Cause you're cool with me. Nice. And I'm cool with him, so... Yeah. Um, here's something like this. Yeah, man, I'll, I'll let you guys know. Yeah. yeah. Well, it was nice to have a lot of people on. It's yeah. fun. My mm -hmm. game yeah. I'm not lagging, so I wonder what's up with you, then. Yeah. Black Girl. Black Girl, yeah. Yeah. 
Alright, see you guys. See ya. How much longer are you gonna stay on? I don't know. I could be on... I'll, I'll be on my... I don't know. Probably a while. Yeah, I, I'll be on for about 40 more minutes. That's how long I usually stay. I'm just trying to find Surtis Quartz. So I can do that storage stuff you mentioned. You don't need Surtis Quartz for A2. Or for refined storage. It... To make a controller, it says you do. No, you don't. You need... Quartz enriched iron, which is one nether port plus three iron. I made quartz enriched iron, but the controller says it needs silicon, so do you not need the controller for the storage? No, you need the controller. Silicon is got, you get silicon by smelting quartz. And you can smelt Certus quartz dust too. I couldn't you find a way to make the quartz dust from nether quartz. Look up silicon. I'm doing that right now. Oh my goodness. Thing, give you, but if you go to smelting, <sighs> nether quartz will turn into silica. You're kidding. Okay. I hate my life. Well, okay. Well, the big thing is I need to find Surtis Quartz eventually. I'm by a meteorite. I may as well. Fair enough. It's, I'm in this deep, quite literally. Well, but also, knowing you, you're going to want to do... Everything. Uh, well, you're going to want to do the... the AE2 anyways. Yeah. Later, maybe, but you'll definitely want to do it. Yeah, but having having a source of quartz, absurdus, when I need it, it's knowing where it is. Can't imagine it would be a bad thing. Hmm. Tin ore. Aside from the fact that that seems to be very, very deep underground right now. A lot of ores in here, though. Yeah. So it's the controller combined with... So are the storage drives just refined storage or also computer craft? Can you use computer craft for storage, too? Computer craft is, is not in this, in this mod pack. It... Computer craft is in this mod pack. You can at least... It's cc colon space tweaked. Oh... Uh... Yeah, I forgot. No, that is, but there's not, like, a mod description for it, so I just haven't bothered. Fair. Yeah, I tried there's doing... There's mod thing in the quest book, so... Yeah, there, there was some funkiness that I wanted to get involved with, with computer craft or had some interest in. Are those the ones where you can make, like... Your own programs? Yeah. Yeah, you do it in Lua. It's all in Lua, And which... then you also make your own, like... Um... Robots. Yeah, that can go and mine shit for you. Yeah, they can carry out the commands you program into them. Yeah, I remember that. So. I did that in that Enigmatica 2 server that we ran. Oh, that was some ambiance. There was some spooky noises, and I'm wondering why. Okay. Torch. Not torch, but... Hmm... A lot of fun stuff, but I have some stuff, a number of things in the pipeline right now just to make this stream look a bit nicer, so I'm excited to get all that going, especially since hopefully if things go right, new Genshin region should mean new people coming to watch. We'll see. Platinum ore, diamond pickaxe. Platinum ore. Mm -hmm. Some other guy also, I mean, tiny like me, but still, he need all the, I need all the publicity I can get. Got me to involve with, hopefully, if it manifests, doing some kind of song cover with him. So we'll see where that goes. Who? Oh, just some random other tiny streamer. Nobody would know. Yeah. You know, another nobody like me. But a slightly bigger nobody. So. Make like a Pokemon in Leech Life. Pickaxe, pickaxe. Yeah. 
But it was funny that, you know, you found that Surtis, but you didn't even really need it. It... Truly one of God's luckiest gamblers. Sure. Truly. And I, and well, I mean, I plan on doing 82 eventually, but nowhere near. Right now? Not yeah. How deep down is this meteorite going to be? I swear. I'm hitting Y level zero and it's still nowhere near. Found stone, I found. I'm at deep slate level. It's still nowhere. Hmm. Copper. It. The utility of break alone is just so useful. That said, it it's not the same as a fortune pick. And I need rabbit's feet to do that. Well, it's life. Yeah, that's the difference between you and me. It's just, you're trying something new and I'm deliberately sticking at least partially to what I know so I can get a foothold in before I try other stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Two kinds of approaches. To each their own. To each their own. I'm mostly other... doing new stuff because I can count on myself to do... Like, I know I'll be able to manage otherwise. So it's like I don't really care about getting a foothold in early. Fair. Like I said... I my, my biggest priority by a large margin... What takes priority? The, my biggest priority by the large margin was getting this storage system set up first. Yeah. That is my current priority, too. Well, arguably, my current priority is finding that sort of quartz. Because I'm in here right now. Well, again, you also don't need sort of quartz. You just need another quartz. Well, yeah, but I'll need it again. I'll need it eventually for something, so I'm trying to find the meteorite at least, so I just know where it is. The only thing you'll need it for is... Or do you need it for computer craft? For computer crafts? Certus quartz. I didn't think you did. Mm hmm. I don't know. It's like you ran a night or that ship slips through the gym. Yeah, now I'm stacked on iron. Nice. Nice. I. Ooh! Listen. What? Awesome. Growing nether quartz, eight nether quartz. So you need eight essences to make the block. Mystical agriculture will grant you, will grow essences of items, and you use eight of them to make the block that you're trying to grow. I think it depends. I thought it was always, I thought it was all one. Oh, okay. Because making, when I would grow obsidian essence, it just gave me, um, when I, when I would grow obsidian essence, it would, you know, I put eight obsidian essence in my, you know, crafting table. It gave me eight obsidian. Yeah. But I just did this with nether quartz, and it gave me 12. Oh, wow. Which is actually awesome. That's huge. That's exciting. Let's sleep. Hmm. Yep. Deep slate is no, 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 no. It's going to wash all this shit it? out, isn't it? Sand could go. God damn. Can. Okay, I can make compress my deep slate. That's good. That's good. Compress the sand. Hmm. Hmm. It. I'm in a position now. Is should be the spot. I'm going crazy. Deep slate uraninite or not poor. Torch. Pickaxe. I am spiraling down. Hmm. Deep slate uraninite or. It's, I'm trying to avoid breaking ores right now that I don't have space to carry. But it's... 
a whole thing. It's just it says there's a meter right here. I can't find anything here. Deep, deep underground. And I'm at Y level 35, and if if it's around here, I have not seen it. Hmm. What are you looking for? The meteorite. The compass is spinning in circles. The mysterious compass, I mean the meteorite compass that you use to find meteorites, but... I guess it could be at bedrock level, maybe, but... It seems a bit preposterous. No, it's not. It should usually be in the overworld. In that case, I am curious as to what might be currently happening. Nice thing is, though, I can very easily compress the deep sled I'm mining. Because of oh, all I the compress. That. Yeah, Fresh yeah. That's so nice. It, for a mod like, mod pack like this, it's absolutely essential. It'd be really funny if somehow I just had a dud and ar arcane debris. Oh, okay. Interesting. That, we got uh, rhyolite, whatever. Gravel. Find out around that arcane debris. Multiple things of this arcane debris. Huh. Uh, and that oh, deep sleep prosperity or it if that meteorite was in the sky I guess it's possible but it'd be really funny dark stone deep sleep hmm dark stone huh. it it's very, very possible that, yeah, I just, the meteorite might not be here. That it might be a dud somehow, and it just decided to screw me. Hmm. Yeah, it's, I've hit bedrock and nothing. It's really, really weird. Huh. Four more things of deep slate so I can evenly compress. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, it. Alright. I guess it's theoretically possible that the meteorite is in the air instead somehow, but. In the air tonight. By Phil Collins. Come on. That jump boost is actually coming in very handy here. But, it's just really weird. Okay. Back home. Hmm. I guess I'll smell some quartz into silicon now, because it's the only thing I really can do. That was rather strange. Hmm. How much... Quartz do I have? Where did I put it? Okay. Should be enough. I just... Not having a backpack is so funny to me. The fact that I just don't have good access to it. Hmm. Controller. Okay. Quartz, machine casing, it's processor, silicon. Okay. It's got four, I'll have enough. It is kind of funny how you just can toss that advanced processor right in a furnace. Alright. 
pensei, ah, também. It is fun that you can make, that you can turn the quartz into silicon, because it, you know, it makes sense, especially with the mine camp stuff. Iron, day, diamonds. Put those diamonds, okay, right here. Diamonds. Redstone. Processor binding. Processor binding. Hmm. Put that there. And blind. It was. Actually had a bit. Of, no, no. We're fine. Shapeless remote advanced processor. And. Let's toss that in. A tiny call. How much will that take? Well, all. Oh. She'll take the same amount of fuel units. Yeah. Advanced processor. Let's make something beautiful happen. Silicon machine casing. Thank you for telling me about that, friend. Very useful information for me. All right. Fine storage. Craft a controller. Put that thing right here. Then. Let's figure out what to do next. Find storage and base materials. Oh, that's fun. Ants basic improved. It's enriched. More processors. Okay. Huh. Processor. Yeah, I just completely skipped the basic and improved processors. Wait. Yeah, because iron, then gold, then diamond. Okay. Well. Next, then cables, blocks, and items next to each other. Extend out refined storage network. Cable. Mm -hmm. More glass. Okay. So I'm gonna go harvest a whole stack of sand. Or more. So how does all that storage work then? What did you say you used for the power? Uh, the Furninator? The Furninator is what it's called. Okay. Furninator generates, interesting, blazing spirited nitro. That, oh wow, that takes dielectric Ace, coal, clay, and lava. Okay. Huh. This powder also works. Clay balls, then. Sweater furninator, and then. Starter basic. Iron capacitors, dielectric casings. It's a lot of. Higher than a lot of wow. Hmm. Yeah, so hmm. still figure out how that storage network works. And you just use it to connect chess? No, you have a controller and then you have storage drives. Oh okay. You have a controller, you have a uh, disk like a, a, a uh, disk drive. Okay. Each of which you can put eight disks inside of it. And the disks can have anywhere, can, can have a certain amount of storage capacity. And anywhere, even powers of two. Okay. So, or even powers of two times a thousand. Oh, wow. Um, and you do that by making individual storage parts. So you can have one that's 1K. 4K, 16K storage part, 64K storage part, 
64k meaning 64,000 items can be stored with this one storage drive. Oh wow. And then you can make another storage house. You basically combine store a one storage housing which you make is a craftable item and a storage part. Combining those two together gives you a certain type of storage drive or a drive with a certain amount of storage. Um, you can get up to 10 you can get up to a billion. Oh wow. For one storage drive. So there is the possibility to store 8 billion items. Well, oh. because you get 8 drives. Yeah. It's uh, it's ridiculous. Um the only reason you'd need that many items um the only reason you need that many uh, that that much storage is if you're making like some ridiculous farms with auto crafting and everything. Yeah. Which is why they give it to you. Hmm. I'm surprised that this it's mostly gravel rather than sand on this riverbed. Hmm. There is a good amount of clay in my cave system, which is nice, but can't solve all of my problems. Okay. Time for orange sand. You know, it would be funny if orange sand became orange glass. It wouldn't make much sense, but it'd be funny. Or orange stained glass. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's what I mean. Hmm. <laughs> Come on, come on. Oh, goodness. It, I need to see if they have the glyph that lets you have. Ooh, the water breathing glyph. It doesn't seem like they have the water breathing glyph in this one, which makes sense because it was actually kind of overpowered. Free. Water breathing on demand. Uh, hmm. Okay. In that case, are you gonna sleep? Uh, I can. Okay. Would be appreciated. eventually want to set up some like mystical agriculture automation because that will look that'll be when you really start moving moving up in the world yeah moving this lot pack forward once you can automate a shit ton of resources that's when you really get it going so mystical agriculture and uh, just from everything i read on this mod pack i'm just thinking about that. okay um, I'm, just from everything I've read on this mod pack, that is by far, like, the number one thing that people recommend if you want to get to Okay. Make, like, they, they all talk about how mystical agriculture is not even just broken, but at, at, at certain points gets to be, like, necessary. Okay. For the amount of um, items that you want to make. So that makes getting sense. something to auto-harvest... Getting, getting the speed up with that thing, but also getting something to auto-harvest it. If you can keep that going and get it into your system, oh boy. Oh boy. That makes sense. So, after I beat... Or beat... After I... Um, I don't even want to say max. But after I... Like, get done with evil craft or at least what I want to get out of evil craft. Like, I don't really care about mob farms right now. Yeah. Um, the biggest thing I want is the rejuvenated flesh, which I'm not too far from getting. Oh, nice. But also, this blood pearl of teleportation looks cool. It's like an, it's a reusable ender pearl. Oh, nice. Um, 
this Connecticut or maybe I don't know if I can put that on the mat on my spot though. I don't really need that though because I have the magnet. Um, insert the desired potion. Oh, so primed pendant. You, it's it's like the it's an infinite durability potion thing. It just consumes blood. Oh, nice. So I'd want the prime pendant. Then there are a bunch of magic stabs. One that summons hordes of zombies. That is very evil craft. Ones that causes an AoE explosion with an AoE attack. Um, then there's this cool thing that's a Scepter of Thunder. Mm, that would be something you would like. But it's a one-time use. Mm -hmm. Okay. But it spawns Thunder when activated. Looks sick. So use it for making impressions. Oh, once I once I start like really flesh out Evilcraft, I also want this broom. This looks sick. Mm. Um, Invar. Once I really. Once I'm satisfied with my progress in evil craft, or at least satisfied enough to move on, I'm gonna com I'm gonna actually complete my base and set up a whole mystical agriculture thing. Because if I can get that going, I want to set up mystical agriculture, and then I'll probably want to either probably set up a reactor or do something with power to get yeah. to move away from this furnator so that I can power whatever mechanism. I want to auto harvest down there. Mm -hmm. and that once I do that, then we're cooking. Because really, yeah. then I can just any I can just plant new items that I want. Um, I can just plant any items I want, or any like I can do this whole mystical agriculture thing, and then once I plant it. I'll just receive a, that item over and over and over again. Um, because of all the growth that'll be happening and yeah. the auto collection that will be dumping it into my computer system. Um, so once once I get that going, then it'll be time for uh, a bunch of other mod packs that I want to try. Mm -hmm. Once you've got your way out I'll of resource constraints. I'll probably start a tech mod and another magic mod. Like, I'll probably go with... Uh, Probably just do Draconic Evolution. But I, I, I like I will do the mod because then when I have access to a bunch of resources or a farm where as long I can just put something in, make a seed for it, and then start getting a lot of that resource. Yeah. Once I start doing that, then then like any mod becomes so much more fun to do because I don't have to sit there and grind a bunch of resources out. You can just chill. Yeah. I can just get a bunch of resources elsewhere. Platinum. Do I have platinum? Platinum or hammer. I picked up some platinum down there, but... Let's see. Uh-huh, okay, raw platinum. It's fun. Hmm. That or hammer. Platinum ore hammer. Okay. PT. Hmm. But yeah, right now I think it's gonna be more about letting this uh, just getting a bunch of blood. Fair. I. I gotta make a bunch more iron to make. Tubes I need, machine casings I need, and processors I need. Just, I could make a blast furnace, that is right. I didn't even think about that. I made a couple blast furnaces. Yeah. It's easy to forget about stuff like that sometimes. Easier than I'd like. Okay. Split this up. Oh, wait. Wait. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And there. I'm just making a platinum ore hammer right now. 
keep things easy right now. Need some stuff anyway, so. Alright, now I'm gonna just raid a bunch of people's bases to see if they have any condensed blood. Fair. Do you have any idea where I am? No, actually. Okay. I'll try to keep it that way. I'm sure I'll find out eventually. Eventually. Hopefully at that point it won't matter anymore. Yeah. But, oh yeah, like, there are, there are different things you can do. Like, um, apply, like, the, the refined storage itself has a way to lock your storage system. To be fair, people could just blow it up. No. Because we said, we talked about Oh, right well, there. right, right. That's just going to be a universal rule for the server. I don't okay. want to see anybody. Like, and I, I like, and I, again, I don't, like, I, we set this up so a lot of people could have fun. All right. But if it comes down to it, I have no problem exercising whatever rules I want in order to keep things chill. Um. The one um, right at spawn? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think TB might actually, have been in there too. Actually kind of cool. To my knowledge. I gotta go down to the lava lake again then. Hmm. He's got a bunch of his, of his flesh. I will take one of his flesh. Goodness. Meat thief. Actual storage. What's enriched iron? Machine casing. I... Hmm. 55. Let's double 55 iron then. I not have that much raw iron. If... I'm not sure how much raw iron I've got right now. Hmm. And then, okay, yeah, I could definitely get... 55 in here if I felt like it. Yeah, let's, let's break that copper ore hammer. Cool. Hmm. Got an iron dust. So the question is how I'm going to make those storage drives. Huh. Grid. That. Oh, that needs... Destruction core? Okay. Oh, that's nothing. Then. Lifting fluid portable grid. Not connected. Not connected to the network. Patterns. And storage. Floppy. Disk drive. There is wireless access. Wireless grid. Wood grid. This. Huh. All right. I guess I'll make a few of these before hopping off. It's enriched iron. But to power it, I'll need. Furninator stuff. Or I could use that hand crank. Be funny. Mm -hmm. Processors. Let's make. I don't know where Jake's keeping all this stuff. Some not, not more silicon. Presumably in that temple. No, but I didn't. He has hardly any inventory space in there. Hmm. He might just keep everything in a big backpack. Disc. Well, Extra disc, wow. Stuff. Infinite. And it has. Recipe disabled, okay. 1k storage part. 4k needs. Storage housing. 1k storage disc. Storage part. It's not bad. A lot of quartz. Huh. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, all right. All right, then. Some funny little discs. Storage disc, 4K storage, and... Huh. Uh... Creative storage disc, 24K. Oh my goodness. What does annoy me is... You can't uncraft... Storage parts. Which means that after the first... Well... I don't know. The good thing about refined storage, though, is that pretty much all of the uh, the parts get used for higher ones too so it's not like you can really over make them that's fair 1k storage disc the big thing is that i can't craft a 1k storage disc in a bigger one or recover what i used to make it that's the thing for me but it's, it's about time for me to hop up but i think i'll get some clay from my mines real quick before that, I, actually might have too. I got a decent amount done actually. Somewhat. But this has been very, very interesting. I like this mod pack a lot already. Yeah, it's really cool. It, it's just, I like how big it is and how it just has more than you could ever yeah, theoretically there's so need. much variety, yeah. Oh goodness. I, mushroom fuel to Enderman. Those Enderman just left. Oh, come on. Come on. Axolotls down here should have the. Because Enderman keeps showing up in my cave and I just never ever have. I hit them once and they disappear and they're just gone. That's what's crazy about it. But, I got a good amount of clay in here, which is nice. For that Ferninator. Mm -hmm. I... Actually having... Two stacks could be good. Should be decent. Just... So many resources show up in... My caves really is the bounty of nature. Let's see if I can kill one Enderman. And oh, and oh wow, we got I got an Ender Pearl. Huh. I see get more of those and find myself a. Oh, where'd it go? Mushroom field ones might not actually be aggressive. Interesting. Don't seem like I can aggro them. Oh, and also there's just a bunch of water underneath here, which gets them teleporting a lot. And can I... There we are, and no pearl that time. Okay. Well, interesting. I might need to get some lava too, probably, but... Hmm. It... It's very, very interesting. There's always something to do. And I guess one of those things right now is going to be to hopefully find a way to make a warp stone so I can get back here quicker. Oh, that's right, this is another part I never saw. Huh. Well, okay. Ah, the ether. Who's over here? Are you in the ether now? No, but I am in. I'm actually, you know what? I'm about to be. This guy. Water bucket in the glowstone portal. Yep. Yep. I've never been to the Aether, I don't think, yet. Yeah, I never was able to play modded Minecraft while the Aether was a thing. What's in this mod bank? Lots of things. Hmm. I am probably going to hop off shortly. Flying whale? Flying whale? 
flying pigs, flying cows. Pigs can't fly. That's preposterous. Oh, right, yeah, they have moas. Right. You know, I always thought that the Aether was more of, like, a joke. What do you mean? Like, oh, if you go, if you put a glow, like, Herobrine. Well, it was a joke because a lot of people, a lot of kids who didn't know it was a mod tried to do it in vanilla and got surprised when it didn't work. Because they were incompletely familiar with the concept of a mod. Well. This tin ore node is massive. As a sort of, there's a little bit of ore over here. I'll mine it and then hop off. And then it just kept having more and more ore in it. It's amusing. It's a good problem to have. Yeah. If I need tin for something down the line, maybe. Come on, come on. And now there's a copper. Copper note at the back of this. It's a bad joke. Oh, was, how many things of copper? Come on. <laughs> okay. This is gonna end. Okay, cool, well. Oh my goodness. Give me a second. Should have put some stuff away from one. But. Okay. So, next time I'm on, I guess priority number one is gonna be actually figure out how to make this storage drive stuff work. That's fitting. Sounds good. Yeah. Things are working decently. So, I'll be hopping off and seeing you later then. See you. Yeah, see ya. And Santa Reagan.